right. Back in. Good bit rate. I'm happy. Ah, oh, what did I leave off on? Probably left myself in town doing nothing. And that's fine. Is this dendro? I know everything else. Welcome here, baby. Alright. Oh, what are all these things? Bishops and where to find them. Talk to Catherine and Liyue Harbor. What's that about? Oh yeah, the uh, the flower event or whatever they call that is over. Six days, six hours, so full week of whatever this is. The Adventurers Guild has been busy collecting information on dangerous geoviship activity in recent days. Catherine of Leo Harba, Harba, <laughs> where am I from? Uh, Boston Harbor um, is commissioning adventurers to investigate further. Four of four remaining. Support record? What's that? No records. Okay. Event guidelines. During the event, Catherine of the Adventurer's Guild will release eight investigative expedition commissions for bishops and where to find them each day, of which travelers can choose four. Once these expeditions are complete, the basic reward may be collected. Additional possible rewards will be collected based on the people chosen to take part in the expedition. People? Okay. As progress is made in the investigative commissions on the hunt will unlock. Travelers will be rewarded accordingly for completing it. When the event ends, you may no longer attempt bishops and where to find them commissions, nor the on the hunt challenges. The event page will continue to be open for three days to better let travelers claim as yet un claim as yet unclaimed rewards. The epilogue of Bishops and Where to Find Them will also be available for three days after the end of the event and will automatically disappear afterward. Friendly Aid. Players may enlist one character belonging to a friend on their friend list for every expedition. The supporting character will also increase odds of attaining additional rewards. Supporting characters may be selected from any of the characters in a friend's character showcase. Oops, I have no friends. That's alright. Sounds fun. Alright. I think I have something in the Blacksmith Forge. Yeah. Obtainium. For sale. Anything? Yeah, you do. <clears throat> Just ate dinner, so I'm a bit hiccupy. I did. Well, let's see. I'll check in with Catherine in a second here. Food delivery. Yeah, I'll be back. I want to check. When does this girl get her shit back? What do you sell here? Oh, she got it back. I think today? Yesterday? Whatever the case. Mine all mine. I wonder, does this mean the guy in Lewa Harbor has his back? I think so. I'm gonna have to go check that in a minute. Hey, what's up, puppers? I missed. Alright, I think I'm gonna start off with commissions. And this one. 
one, two, three, they're all in a line. I like it. Oh, I must, uh, must be full up. Yeah, I'm full up. I logged off early last night to play Loop Hero. Loop Hero, great game, loving it. What's up, Sarah? No time is a good time for goodbyes. Can I just port? I mean, I guess I'll run it just for the hell of it. I'll be back for these birdies. I was like, yeah, I think I'm going the wrong direction, right? Uh, is. Take out. Not yours. <laughs> Whose is it? supposed to do then? Weird. Ah. Look for the person. Timid Morrow. Well, it took me so long. I still have a minute and a half or more. world, in my world, the customer is not always right. Yeah, no worries. It was on Bluetooth, <laughs> asshole. Don't be on Bluetooth in public. It's annoying. <laughs> Olaf. Metal. <laughs> Since I'm here, I'm just gonna hit up a few points. So I don't have to come back. Sarah can wait for her freaking money. After this shit I had to put up with. <laughs> Damn Uber customers.
Oops. Where's the other one? Find it once I have some more stamina. <sighs> well, I gotta raise Barbara to 70, don't I? I think so. Maybe that's something I'll do today. That was already back there. Bob would need some wevels. Baba waba. It's an old uh, Saturday Night Live reference, I believe, if I remember correctly. One last mushy, and I'll go back to uh, Catherine. Oh, maybe one more. Maybe uh, another. Wait, who's got the spring water? I think someone around here's got some spring water that I never use. <laughs> hey, Marla. I'll find them some other time. Huh. Wait, was it this guy? I always forget. You. Yeah, it's Hopkins. Huh. One of the... Huh. Huh. Alright, back to Kath. <laughs> Weird neck pain, kind of love it. <laughs> what do we got here? towers.
Oh, this guy trying to drop waters on me. Hey, what was that about? Could have run. Didn't have to. But I did. Ooh, some lamp glass. Lamp glass? Oh. Thought I was looking in the stump. Nope. Alright, next commission, please. Oh, it's right up here. Oh, this should be fun. Down and everyone laughed. You're He's the ultimate bohab. Bohab! You're in for a little. You're in for a little shock. Nice and spicy! Wind blade! And slapped his PB around for no reason. Oh, for chaos devices. Gotcha. Oh, so close. It's so far to 45. Alright, one more to go here. I think I saw it over here. Squirrel, you just stand there and take it. That sucks because I like squirrels in real life, they're funny. and easy. So I want 45. Well, part of the reason I want 45. Get my world level up. Wait, what was that? Daily commissions and expeditions. Oh, yeah, my expeditions. Doi. Forgot all about that. Two thousand. Twelve thousand three hundred and something to go. Add Astra Abyssos. 
What's this about my socks? Wait a minute. I hate how they do. I hate how that does. There we go. Oh, jeez. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Welcome. Official. It's official. You're going out on an expedition. Gene, go. Man, my eyes. It's so cold and so dry at the moment. When you're high up, everyone can hear your voice. <laughs> Welcome to Mars. Hey, where'd the birds go? I didn't kill them. Why aren't they back? Eh, whatever. I'll collect these uh, dandelions for now. And a little more mushroom action. Tell him it's not real. It's your childish goddamn imagination. Wind blade. Wind blade. Beauty game beauty. Now, do I have to spend? Uh, the events don't make me spend dust on them, do they? I don't think so. We got a ways to go here. Probably gonna have to go fight some Remo Geovishaps. Tonight. But for now, let's go see what the hell is up with this. Oh, yeah, I got my frost bearing tree dailies. It's right. Weeklies. Bi weeklies. Something. But I gotta find out what this is all about. Go. Sure, game. Let me keep rubbing my eyes here. One second. Oh, jeez. I hate dry. Why can't it just warm up? It actually did warm up for about a week. It was in the 40s. All week. So, like... It was 6 to 10 degrees C for, like, a week. And right now, it's, like, minus a half a degree Celsius. Wind chills are minus like three. Ugh, hate it. Drives me bonkers. Actually. I wanna spend 1200 bucks on 10 of these? Yeah, I do. White iron? Sure. Noctilucent? Nah. Got 134 of them. Should be enough for now. Should I save this money? Ugh, 
you again. Me? Look, I told you, we're not interested in the kind of cooperation you describe. Come on, there's no reason to get upset. Look, one of your members is an avid supporter of my proposition. Well, I'm not, because I have no friends, but that's okay. I have to agree. Since our last negotiation, I've come up with a new proposal, which I think you'll find has far more benefits for you. First things first, Wangsheng Funeral Parlor will prioritize the Adventurer's Guild requests above all others. You'll also receive 100 of our signature wooden coffins for free, together with your first order. That's not all. We also provide an on-site cadaver collection service covering almost all regions in Liyue. Now, we do charge a slight premium for a very small number of especially dangerous areas, but, but don't you worry about that. I promise you, it's still very affordable. <laughs> I don't think you're hearing me. Okay, all right. I get it. You want to bargain a little more. But our offer as it stands is already quite a good deal, don't you think? Just think about it. An adventurer's life is full of unexpected threats. It's only natural to take precautions. Mend the roof before it rains, as they say. Yeah, no. I'm not so sure that saying applies in this context. Speaking of precautions, I'd rather focus on keeping my adventurers safe in the first place. It's time for you to go. I have to attend to other matters. Oh, wait, hold on! Oh, what would you say to a group discount? 30% off for parties of 10? Director, please, you did your best. We don't need another clash with the Millilith. Uh, if Paimon understood all that correctly, it seems... Like she's trying to sell them the funeral parlor services. Eh, this will get us nowhere. Uh, yeah, nothing left to do here. Let's go back to Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. Rejecting a once in a lifetime opportunity. It's their loss. Some things are inevitable, it's only a matter of time. This is. Oh, yeah. Well, that's kind of what I'm doing. Uh, seems like the old ways are the most reliable after all. Mung, are you done preparing our promotional materials? Uh, my apologies. I'm only about halfway through. Do you really think they will be effective? Trust me, they're going to work wonders. This marketing strategy has been used by Wangsheng Funeral Parlor for generations. Clients in need come to our door and write down their commissions on blank wooden tiles. Then they squeeze those inside the parlor through the crack under the door. I fulfill the request written on each tile to make sure our clients are satisfied with the service, no matter if it's an obituary, cremation, or funeral that they seek. Although... It is a bit of a hassle with the constant back and forth. If only we could burn them by the batch. No, Director, I'm not asking about the wooden tiles themselves, but about the special offer they advertise. Special offer? <laughs> Wangsheng Funeral Parlor should keep up with the times. Just think about it. If we don't attract new clients, we'll be left with nothing, won't we? Business development is a crucial element of every prosperous enterprise. I've been trying various marketing strategies ever since I became the director. I put up posters just like all the other shops, but the Millilith promptly removed them. Then I organized the Wangsheng Visitor's Day, but no one showed up. Well, that doesn't come as a huge surprise. And finally, I discovered that the traditional ways are the most reliable after all. I took inspiration from the wisdom of previous directors. So now, I go from door to door looking for people and organizations willing to cooperate. Just like during our visit to the Adventurers Guild. That's what I mean by business development. The other method I'm trying is using the wooden tiles as coupons. Just by writing things like, buy one, get one free for the holder of this tile on them. <laughs> what do they buy and what do they get? A solid and durable second home, of course. 
They may not need it right away, but they can be sure that when they do, it will still be as good as new. <clears throat> it won't start deteriorating before you finish doing so yourself. That's the Wangsheng <laughs> Funeral Parlor quality guarantee. I, I, I don't know what to say to that. All right, Mung. Keep adding those special offers to the wooden tiles. The future of our business depends on it. <sighs> I'm still not sure this will work. Oh, I get it. You think that our special offer is not comprehensive enough, right? It is true. I was offering all kinds of great benefits to the Adventurers Guild because they are a new client. But in doing so, I neglected my old clients. <sighs> You're right. It's unfair. Hmm. Let me do some market research. Wait here, my faithful assistants. I'll be back with you in a moment. It shouldn't take too long. Paimon already told you we're not your assistants! <sighs> Whatever. Guess we got dragged into somebody else's business again. Let's look around while she's away. So this is obviously the uh, continuation of the Hu Tao storyline. Figured why not at least do that step. Well, let's head on back to the Geo Bishop thing at the Adventurers Guild now that it's out of the, the story quest is out of the way of Catherine. This is what I really wanted to do. Running out of time. Hey, Catherine. Have you been well, Catherine? Another emergency, eh? Geo Bishop reports. Oh, no. Dire consequences. Have you tried asking about the, or asking the Millilith about it? Well, what do you need me to do? Thanks for agreeing to help. Yes. Huh, interesting. So I should do all the tough ones, right? Tough, quotation marks. Um. Wait, I don't get it. Can I put myself out on these things? Like, my, my characters that are in my party and shit? I do have one friend. <laughs> so wait. It takes 12 hours to do this? Uh-huh. Well, I'm kind of out of time. Thank you. 
Interesting. Well, I guess I don't have to do anything, but I was hoping to go hunt, hunt some monsters myself. But bounty release. So what? Huh. Well, whatever. We'll find out. Key difference between these and normal ones is the guild has already conducted some preliminary investigations. If we act on the information, we have blah blah blah. Dramatically improve our efforts. Then we take them out, I presume? Combat is my strong point. Wait, because I started late in the day, does that mean I'm kind of screwed for the first day? Is that, is that what happened? I don't know. All right, let's uh, let's continue with this story quest just because I've been doing it. So let's do it. I don't want to wait too long. I don't care if I'm capped out on dust. What's up, fairy lady? You must be the director's new hires. Not us. We're just very curious about Wangsheng Funeral Parlor and Hu Tao. Well, I wouldn't get too curious if I were you. Too much knowledge isn't good for ordinary folk. The director is tactful when it comes That's to what, what the Democrats want you to think. Be known. Oh my god, she's so hard to Let's find. Settle, then. Write it like this. Wangsheng Funeral Parlor Bumper Sale. Buy one, get one free. Buy two, get three free. More for your Mora. <laughs> I love it. Better than all that lifeless brochure stuff. We want people to feel warm and fuzzy. Uh, but, Director, isn't lifeless the name of the game in this industry? That's old hat. We're opening up new ground. Why does Wangsheng Funeral Parlor need to open up? <sighs> yes, Director. Poor guy's giving up. Right. We should get going. I am not letting new business escape us. We? As in us? <laughs> Who else? Do you see anyone else around here? Oh, well, you probably wouldn't see them if there was. Stop adding little afterthoughts like that! It creeps people out! <laughs> Just a joke, sorry. Everything you see is everything that's present. For the moment, at least. Comforting. Uh, lighten up. The way I see it, people make death scarier than it really is. What people truly fear about departing this world is suffering and regret. To deal with the trauma, they let their imaginations run wild with notions of ghosts and evil spirits. <sighs> baseless fantasies what we've ended up with is a topic that people are morbidly afraid of talking about if i don't broach the subject then wangsheng funeral parlor won't be long for this world but i've seen a ghost oh more approachable and appeasable than you'd imagined well i wouldn't say that let's just say at least it didn't hurt us you must have come across a particularly ferocious entity how should I put this? Most spirits are incapable of harming ordinary folks. The job of Wangsheng Funeral Parlor is to guard the border between life and death. One component of this is correcting notions of death and the afterlife that people may hold. Simply put, for those unable to see the border, they're best kept as far away from it as possible. So for ordinary folks, the best case scenario is ignorance of all matters concerning spirits in the afterlife, or even better, a belief that none of it exists. Then you really don't have any excuse for spooking the heck out of people. 
you make it sound so abominable. I'm just trying to get them to see the humor in it all. Uh, I want my own response, like, you could kill me whenever you want, baby. I never thought you'd be but such no. a bore. Never mind. If you stick by me, everything will become clear. All right, let's get going. Follow me. Director, wait. What about Big G? Don't forget. Big G? Who's that? We've been in Lila for ages and never heard that name. Oh, nothing. Just something Mom's been pleading with me to take care of. Should be a piece of cake. Where are we going? If it's a fight, I'll help. To visit an important potential client. I'll lead the way. Big G. Who? I don't know about no Big G, but I got Big D for her. <laughs> Little Wu. Uh, sorry, who are you? Hello. I know I'm that voice. Cao, director of the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. Okay, so why would someone from Wangsheng Funeral Parlor be looking for me? Mm, nothing major. How are you feeling these days? Any aches or pains? You shouldn't ignore them, by the way. Very often they're an omen of something terminal. When we're healthy, it's easy to forget the crushing fragility of life. So, aches and pains, best to keep an eye on them. What are you getting at? I'm in great health and enjoying life very much, thank you. Great health, Don't yeah, sure, Tubby. Poor soul. Goodbye. <laughs> Why did they get angry? Little Wu's boobs What's are bigger than Hu <laughs> That's funny. Hyman thinks it's because they're coming from the director of a funeral parlor. <laughs> well, basically what I'm saying about Little Wu is he's probably got diabetes. Kind you, not the kind you're born with. Wait, where am I going here? Around the back? Yeah, uh huh? Moo moo. Uh, and you are. Be quick. I'm busy. Hello there. Would you be interested in understanding a bit about our services at the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor? Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. Uh. I'm not in need of your services. So you're out here looking for new customers? Don't you think this might be a bit of a crass way of going about it? Hardly. Isn't this the fashion these days? Bring the service to the customer and all that. I'm not sure it's every service that falls into that. Uh, anyway, please bother someone else if you don't mind. Uh, another failure. Still... Not the end of the world. Paimon's curious. Does this approach ever work out for you? Well, uh, since I'm here... Hey Rex, what's up? How's it going tonight? I think this guy ought to have uh, reset by now, right? Yeah, he did. Just uh, going through... Since I ran into it, I'm going through the, uh, the Hu Tao storyline. It's cute so far. All about death and all. Oh, and I did, uh, I did start the... What do you call it? Uh, those Geo Bishop expeditions. It turns out someone did make me a friend, uh... What's his name? Hmm. That Gundam guy. So I got some people to help out. It's cool. Hong Chi. Is that how you say that? I know your face. The Wangsheng Funeral Parlor Director, right? I'm sorry, I'm really in no need of it. Don't apologize, get to know us. We've got a new sale going on. 
Ever hear the saying, out with the old, in with the new? Well, going out with a bang is the best way to start off in style on the other side. <laughs> if you keep talking like this, I'll have to call the Millilith. No, no, no. Okay, relax. We're leaving. But Wangsheng Funeral Parlor awaits your distinguished patronage. Even Only funeral parlor in town. <laughs> you don't need to drum up business, but that's okay. There's no persuading them. Are you trying to make me feel better? Thank you. Seems you understand me far better than most people. Not really. This is just getting really uncomfortable. Enough business development. Please help me find someone. Business development? Is that what you see this as? Surely you don't think all that was business Indeed. development? Then what was it exactly? Traumatization for its own sake? No, no, no. The business development ended after the discussion with the Adventurers Guild. <laughs> I was helping to find somebody for Mung. You remember Big G? Rings a bell. As it turns out, the Big G that Mung is looking for is a ghost adrift in the mortal realm. The three we saw just now were all people I suspected of being followed by Big G. But having seen them, I didn't sense the presence of anything otherworldly. So we just had a quick chat, and I left it at that. That was stopping for a quick chat. Why didn't you say so? Paimon thought you had some kind of sixth sense for, uh, people in declining health. Huh? What would I need that kind of ability for? I'm no doctor. <laughs> Were you seriously hoping that the director of the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor was going to start healing people? Or... Paimon was trying to subtly imply that... Uh, never mind. Paimon wouldn't know how to explain subtlety in a way you'd understand. <sighs> well, let's leave that for now and head back to Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. This Big G matter is very closely linked to Meng. Big G. Sounds like a nickname of, I don't know, some West Coast gangster. Oh, just 34k for doing that. Okay. Hey, Mung. Mung, I'm back. I'm afraid we're still no closer to finding Big G. Oh yeah, Otto. As I'm sitting here taking a drink. Well, I'm just sorry for the trouble. I've already searched in all the likely places. Who is this Big G anyway? Someone I can find with my uh, my spirit I vision. Start at the beginning. My home was in the vicinity of Wuong Hill. In my youth, I had a good many friends there. Big G was one of them. We were the best of friends. Inseparable, really. But one day, there was an accident. And that was the end of him. I've never forgotten. Too many memories, I suppose. Wow, did he see it happen? I often return to Wuong Hill. But recently, after one such visit, I started to feel strange. Now, every night, Big G appears in my dreams. I can't help but wonder, did I disturb him somehow? Well, that thing doesn't happen, or that kind of thing doesn't happen. Perhaps. I don't have proof, but I can't stop worrying. I get more anxious every day. How would I ever come to terms with my childhood friend becoming an evil spirit? <sighs> That's why he joined Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. In place of a salary, I'm helping him deal with this matter. Jeez, you're not in paying him? In fact, what Mung has said is entirely Ouch. plausible. Spirits on occasion do find a way into our world. But as for evil spirits, I think you're scaring yourself. Even I have only encountered malevolent forces a handful of times. But are you sure there's no danger? Free I labor indeed. for him to go around harming people. You see what I mean? Look at the state of him. If we can't find Big G, it'll eat away at Monk forever. 
Those people we found today were also Mung's childhood friends. I thought there was a good chance Big G might have hidden among them. But here we are, empty-handed. Wong Hill, childhood friends? <sighs> Seems like we're out of leads. Uh, sorry, excuse me. Is this Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor? My name's Luo Chung. I've had this awful feeling recently, like something's staring at me. Some of my friends and I went to Wu Wang Hill the other day on a dare. After I returned home, I fell ill. I've been having recurring nightmares, but the doctors can't find anything wrong with me. I think that it's a curse, right? I've been cursed by a demon! Say no more. There's no doubt it's a demonic curse, all right, and a serious one at that. You believe so, too? That it's just like they say in the tales of old. The vengeful spirits of the gods who fell in the Archon War return to cast their evil curses upon mortals. And if the curse isn't lifted, it will burn through the body, laying waste to flesh and bone. Oh, what a wretched end! The symptoms I'm having are just like those described in the tales! Wu Wong Hill? Hmm. No, I don't think it was a curse. It was probably just Big G. Hold your horses, both of you. There's no need to creep each other out. Isn't that exactly what you like to do, though? Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor specializes in demonic stuff like this, right? Help me! I beg you! I'm too young to die! All right, all right. Don't panic. Leave it to me. You've come to the right person. However, in order to lift the curse, we need a suitable location, and we need to make some preparations. Come and I need to. Trusty assistance. Yep. I'm going to need your help. I guess I'll come too. Help him make the preparations first. The incense exorcism, the one I taught you. When you're ready, come and find me. Once we've finished with this, we'll get back to the big G matter. Okay, I guess. Right. Let's go. They're not linked? I'm confused. <laughs> yeah, I'll just hoof it. It's not too far. Further than I thought. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, it's cool. Oh, I gotta go get them silk flowers and blaze lilies up there. And these. Do some fighting. So, what mysterious rituals are you gonna perform here? No ritual at all. We just need to kill some time. Eh? Wait, you didn't take all that vengeful God's curse stuff seriously, did you? <laughs> they were eradicated ages ago. You saw those two. One thinks he's been cursed, and the other one believes his friends turned into an evil spirit. It's hard to reason with them. <sighs> now you see why I believe that ordinary folks should be kept in the dark. I've seen too many people lose their senses on account of things like this. If you want to calm them down, you need to convince them with something tangible. And the best way to do that is to make a great show of destroying the boogeyman they believe in before their very eyes. Like that might work if you were trying to cheer up a three-year-old. Oh, how old are you, Paimon? Why would you ask that? Paimon just wants to know why we can't tell everyone the truth. Because you can't guarantee that telling an ignorant person the truth will improve the situation instead of exacerbating it. What I can do is pretend to pull back anyone who believes their time is nigh. But since the curse is imaginary, our fix will also be make-believe. Makes sense. 
Why would anyone believe that it's a curse? Do you know the history of the Yaksha? Yeah, man, she does make sense. Uh, I know some bits and pieces. They once fought against the ancient gods. They fought brilliantly in a battle that engulfed the whole world in darkness. Although the gods were defeated in the end, their resentment persevered. That resentment turned into a pestilence spreading amongst the ordinary folk. Hysteric people mistook it for the curse of the gods. The plague took the lives of many, which only furthered its spread, as the dead were a breeding ground for the disease. Then someone discovered how to prevent it from spreading, purify the air, and burn the bodies of the deceased. The pioneers of these practices were, you guessed it, the founders of the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. Paimon didn't see that coming. Really? Yes. Anyway, it took many years, but eventually the plague was completely eradicated. <sighs> We've dealt with similar phenomena multiple times throughout the ages. Each time we successfully restored the balance between life and death. To sum it up, we are gatekeepers, guarding the border for the sake of both the living and the dead. <laughs> so that's what you meant about guarding the border. So when I say this curse is just a figment of the imagination, I say it with more certainty than most. But I also can't really go telling people that the ancient plagues were real or it would incite panic. <sighs> anyway, let's wait a bit more and get ready mm. for the show. Plagues. This monolith will Viruses. Make a really great prop. Panic. Sounds familiar. Ah, oh, you're finally here. We just finished our preparations. Now, look here. This device is used to drive away evil spirits. It'll absorb the curse inside you and cause it to take a physical form. But don't worry. The traveler here is a seasoned warrior and will assure our safety. Doing the dirty work again. Oh, oh yeah. Right. I forgot to tell you. <laughs> It'll be fine. Will that really solve my problem? Trust the director. She well, might look like I a don't know. She may be, right? But she's serious about everything she does. Nah, she is. Is she? How can I don't you know. Call me a weirdo. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't you say it's more charmingly naive or disarmingly different? <laughs> All right, let's get down to business. My glamorous assistant, please activate the device. Okay, who am I fighting? Is it really possible to materialize the curse? You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. This boy first. Did he die? Did he die? Hey, hey, hey. Enough of that. Do it, thank you. You're in for a little shock. Yeah, no one thought that's all right. Forty eight percent. Oh, these boys. Keyboard. Did the curse leave your body? Yeah. Uh, yes. I feel more invigorated than ever before. I'm cured. Uh, I can't express how grateful I am for your and the Traveler's help. If it hadn't been for you, the curse would have taken my life. Ah, uh, great. In which case, I guess now I can tell you. Shh, da, da, quiet. Da, 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 da. You've been pranked. Uh. Uh, uh, what? This exorcism device, people like you wouldn't recognize it, but it's just an old ley line monolith, deceptively effective at attracting monsters. And those were real monsters, not a manifestation of your curse. <laughs> so riddle me this. If I didn't do anything to lift the curse, then what's the cause of your sudden recovery? The curse wasn't real? Then why was I sick? Well, you caught a cold, ate something bad, or just scared yourself sick. It's anyone's guess, but I'm leaning towards the last option. 
Wouldn't be the first time in my career. How unexpected. I also didn't expect that, but uh, still, I'd like to thank you. Uh, don't mention it. I found a way to deal with your fears this time, but I can't do it over and over again. So I'd appreciate it if you try not to give in to superstitions in the future. Human life is short. Enjoy it while it lasts. Wow. I... Uh, what a weird thing to say. Uh, I... I shall head back. I'm sorry for troubling you. I feel relieved to see that it wasn't Big G's doing. However, unless he crosses the border, there will be no end to his antics. Since we are done with the matter at hand, can we resume our search for Big G? I believe that won't be needed. He found us first. Big G? Uh, um, I didn't mean to bother you. Shit. Any of you. This is Big G? He's just a child? Eh, no paying, I guess. Well, he is a spirit. It's quite normal Long that he looks paid. just like he did when he left this world. Um, that's not what Paimon imagined when Paimon first heard the name Big G. Let's bring him back to Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. We have much to do. Hey, I got paid. Sorta. Of. Damn, that guy's been on a break for a long time. While I'm passing by. <laughs> hmm, thought there was a blazer over there. Maybe not. <laughs> There's one or two more, but I could come back. Yes, it's, it's around here somewhere. Whatever. Ha 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 ha! I saw that, and the one up there. Hold on a second. Still going. After all that's happened, Paimon's not even sure what's going on anymore. So Big G's not an evil spirit? Actually, I'm not surprised in the slightest. Remember what I said? There's only so many evil spirits in this world. It was a twist of fate that made him leave Wuwang Hill in the first place. Now for some reason he can't go back. I'll take him this back. This explanation sounds a bit far-fetched to Paimon. Actually, she pretty much summed it up. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't ever question my professional instincts. I just wanted to check up on my friends. That's why I came to Liyue Harbor. I promise I wasn't up to any mischief. I never wanted to scare anyone. A few days ago, some people came to Wuwang Hill on a dare. I heard them saying they come from Liyue Harbor, so I followed one of them back and ended up here. Oh, it must have been poor Lo Chung that he followed. Maybe he didn't notice you, but he could still feel your presence. Now we know what caused his nightmares. Uh, I was discovered? Sort of. Well, I assume so, otherwise he wouldn't have been scared half to death. Why didn't you come looking for Mung sooner? Yeah, Hotel and Mung were searching for you all over the place. Oh, well that's because I couldn't find them. It's my first time in Liyue Harbor. 
and I got lost in the city. Now that you mention it, he is like nine. He always had a poor sense of direction. When we were kids, he'd never go down the hill by himself. We always had to lead him. So all of this was just because you got lost? Why didn't you just fly? Like any other gooster spirit? Don't you think it's much easier to find your way from up above? I can't. It's too high for me. I get scared. That's right, yes. He used to be so afraid of heights that he wouldn't even so much as look down the hill. <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. <laughs> I knew I wasn't supposed to show myself to the living, and with so many people walking around Leo Harbor, my only choice was to hide. I wouldn't have found you if it weren't for the Leyline Monolith's call. I'm so relieved that you haven't become an evil spirit. Like I said, don't ever doubt my professional instincts. <laughs> now, all we have to do is escort this lost child back to Wuong Hill, and we should be done and dust to dusted. But he just said he wanted to visit his friends. Apart from me, there's also little Wu, Mu Mu, and Songza. Well, if that's the case, we can't let him down. We'll ask them all to help us prepare a farewell ceremony for Big G. Oh great, we're running we'll around. Big G back to Wulong Hill. You meet with those three and ask them for keepsakes to symbolize each one of them during the ritual, then come and find us. They're all friends. Can't we just go there all together? Or maybe we can take Big G to them. Um, that's not a good idea. I don't want to scare them. I do. Hmm, I wouldn't want ordinary folks to become superstitious. The less they know, the better. So be careful what you say when you collect the keepsakes. Are we really going with Hu Tao's plan? At least by keeping things low key, we won't be giving anyone nightmares. Good. I was just here four minutes ago. Sorry, I won't be needing the funeral parlor's services anytime soon. Meg said he's an old yes, friend. We grew up together. But we still keep in touch even now. I don't know why he started working for Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor. To be honest, I find their director to be quite peculiar. But he must have had his reasons. He's on his own now, after all. And he still can't get over what happened to Big G. Did he tell you about it? Yeah, he did. Um, if you could pick one thing to give to Big G as a keepsake, what would you choose? Just, you know, theoretically speaking. We're just being hypothetical here. Definitely not gonna actually go commemorate him or anything. <laughs> That's a little bit on the nose here, come on. I'd cook something for him. Oh. He could eat spicy food like no other. His favorite meal was extra spicy Jue Yun chili chicken. I can make it for you if you bring me some Jue Yun chilies. Got him right I'm here. I'm sure he'd appreciate the flavor of his childhood years. And I still use that old recipe. Deal! Just give us a minute. Let me tell you how it Jue Yun chilies are a common sight in the. Great, this should be enough. I'll get started on the Julian chili chicken. I guess you've got other folks to try. Oh god, I'm gonna have to come back. When Jeez. everyone's ready, I'll get the dish over to you. Oh, okay. Great! See you later! Uh how do we know about the others? What does she have again? 
Oh, that's right. I knew I had to come back for her for some reason. I think that opened up at 40. I didn't even remember. And I caught her out of the corner of my eye. Food in town. Bro. Uh, not you again. I told you, I'm not interested in the inner workings of Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor. Mun told us about you. You're good friends, right? Uh, that's true, yes. I come to think of it, I remember he did join Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor recently. It didn't take long for his good friends to figure out why. <sighs> the Big G incident. But I know there's nothing we can say to help him get over it. Letting go of the past is a painful process. It's had to have been know. years, though. I mean, so, come on. Is Big G the reason you're here to see me? How did you know? We didn't even say anything. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm a businessman. I won't go spilling your secrets. Everyone hears the name Moo Moo and thinks I must be dim-witted. I never heard the end of it when I set up shop. But I'd say I proved a few people wrong. Here. Take this. It's a top-of-the-line toy box we all dreamed of owning as kids. Back then, none of us could afford it. We were penniless. Today, business is booming. I ended up buying loads of these. It was a dream come true. Wow! You must be, like, super rich! <laughs> uh, for me, it's a memento of a childhood long gone. Without it, we wouldn't be where we are today. So, having found me, I guess you'll be looking for Little Wu and Tsongzi next. Mm hmm We already saw Little Wu. Now we gotta find Tsongzi. I see. If it's Tsongzi you're after, let's meet at the overpass at Feiyun Slope. It's just above the staircase leading down to the dock. I've got an errand to run. I'll come find you as soon as I'm done. Okay. She's above? Wait, what? Ah. Ooh. Huh? You're all here! Reminiscing about old times. Thinking back to past events. We've been at it for years. Our hometown was completely destroyed in a disaster, so we've got nowhere to go back to. Now, home is wherever friends are. They've just been telling me you're looking for keepsakes? I make artisan sow lanterns down by Liyue Harbor. I guess they represent me better than anything. A few days ago, I bought some quality plostrite shards. They're currently all in the warehouse at the dock. I've already spoken to the manager. Could I ask you to retrieve them for me? Of Seems course. Like you already know what's going on. Be back in a jiffy. <laughs> Ooh, all the way over here. Jeez. Hi, we're here to pick up the plastrite shards for Sansa. Uh, I think he mentioned it. Uh, he, yes, she, here you it, are on the okay. register, no problem. The plastrite shards are over in that crate there. Please, help yourselves. Doesn't seem like they're here. Let's look someplace else. These look like what Sansa was talking about. Let's head back.
Fetch quests. Gotta love them. Try your luck betting on Jade? Thanks to both of you. This looks like great stuff. Please, wait a moment. This is the final step. Okay, there we go. I wrote all five of our names inside the lantern. You know, during the annual lantern rite, we all release a lantern like this. No matter what the days may bring, whichever roads we choose to take, while this rite remains observed, each of us remains the same. As for the matter of Big G, the three of us have discussed amongst ourselves and agreed we won't press you on it. But if you get the chance, please let them know we're doing well, and that the things we once spoke of, they've all come to pass. And you can count on us. I want to say that, though. Eh, whatever. Thank you. We'll pass it on. Big T is lucky to have friends like you. Dialogue choices don't really matter in this game. Let's go to Wulong Hill and find Hu Tao and the others. All right. I'm not hoofing it this time. Sure, damn sure. Um, wait a minute. Eh, either way, close enough. Deciding which one to teleport to just wastes three seconds it would take between the two. Uh, ooh, hello. Glad I picked this way. Someone needs assistance. Oh, wait. The other one would have been better. Huh. Who knew? Glad I took that detour then. Nevertheless, when it comes to things like ghosts and ghouls, spirits and souls, the one thing everyone knows is you never know what to expect. Which explains why they were reluctant to pry and find out the full story. Which is just as well, because if they had attempted to, it would have been too much for me to deal with. Uh, I can't tell if you're serious anymore. Guard the border between life and death. This is Wangsheng Funeral Parlor's most important responsibility, and I'm stricter than most. So what about us? Does it matter if we cross the border? Of course not. After all, you were caught up in all this already, just like Meng. It's not the end of the world if you catch a glimpse behind the curtain. And where we're going, don't be surprised at what you may see or what may occur. All of it exists within the border between the living and the dead. An ordinary place, really. The only special thing about it is that nobody really knows about it. Whatever you do, don't get all worked up over nothing, okay? Or else by the time we're out, I'll have to erase your memories. <laughs> so listen to everything I say. Let's go. Paimon's scared. But like Hutao says, we're already caught up in this. 
We better see it through to the end. Spooky. Oh, 35. I think I'm okay. of old. This is just a place where the ley lines tend to go a little bit haywire. So keep your cool. Follow me. The farewell ceremony site is just up ahead. That pattern looks familiar. From the right angle, you can make out the whole thing. From a right angle? Oh, just like this right angle. Time. Um. Ah. Ah, there we go. Leave it all to me. Come a little closer. I didn't kill the guy. Whoops. You're in for a little shot. <laughs> Treasure chests. Nothing in those barrels. That sucks. By the way, I imagine Adventurers Guild members are good at making order of things. See if you can find a way to get the right things into the right places. Usually it requires a bit of destruction as well as elemental reactions. Walk into it, gotcha. Oh, there we go. Mmm, tasty. I 
something in the straw pile? Nope. Time to go. Ooh, thirty K. Yikes. Is there anything ever in those? I don't know. Doesn't look like it. Um. What's in there? Down here? First one. Uh oh, did I bring enough stamina? Probably not. I did. Woohoo! Spoopy. I here already? Weird. Nice and spicy. <laughs> Race you. Huh? Isn't this where we just were before? Um I guess not. What of that is going on? Have we even been moving forward this whole time? It's almost 
feels as if we're constantly being sent back to the beginning. Everything resets. <laughs> Well, the, uh, the dialogue is progressing, so I imagine I'm doing the right thing. We're stuck! The spirits have trapped us! <laughs> Don't be daft! You've put my mind at rest. Seems it's not easy for ordinary folks to cross over. So you set us up? Yeah. If you don't have enough, then why not just carry it through a few more times? Do I gotta carry it with me? Alright. I get it. I'm a dummy. I should have figured that out myself. Could have figured that out myself. If I'd have gone through another three or four times. I'm just going to run straight there. I got to bother with those barrels this time. the two, I think, right? I hope. At least for this section. We're stuck! The spirits have trapped us! <laughs> Don't be daft! You've put my mind at rest. Seems it's not easy for ordinary folks to cross over. Oh, pretty. So you set us... Finally! Haima thought we were going to be trapped in that weird place forever! That's exactly the point! Trespassers end up running scared. So, that's the weird stuff out of the way, right? Yep. <laughs> Just dive off the edge here. What? Sure, why not? Leave it all to me. Great place to hide a chest. Oh well. Assistance. 
know to look in bushes now. Nothing in that one, but. Welcome to the farewell ceremony site. Our destination is just up ahead. I know you're excited, so feel free to have a look around and talk amongst yourselves. Soon you'll find out there's nothing special about this place. Needs assistance. Hmm. Someone needs assistance. Are you clients? Apologies. This is just a little unexpected. Seeing that it was Hu Tao that brought you puts me at ease. But I'm afraid we don't have the means to entertain guests here. That's all right. My name is Lan Si. I've been waiting for someone for a long time now. Exactly how long, I couldn't really say. Everyone says waiting is difficult. But walking, watching, talking to newcomers, and the old crowd, it helps to pass the time. I can keep waiting, but... Who knows whether what I'm waiting for will ever come to pass. It's all the same to me. Waiting's all I can do anyway. But if you too are looking for someone important to you, it's best not to keep waiting forever. I was just looking for that chest that was over there, but, you know. Hmm. Oh, it's cool. Oh, wow. Ah, oh, invisible wall. Crap. That's an RPG no-no right there. But I understand it. Someone needs assistance. Guess there's one right here, too. Nope. I'll catch up. There it is. I like that they uh, they actually let us run around down here. That's pretty cool. I'll catch up. All right, more talking. Shoot me! Are you new here? <laughs> what a coincidence! So am I. I can't believe how nice the scenery is. I thought it'd be all pitch black and freezing cold with no sense of space or time. Here I can finally work out a lifetime of emotions. It's fantastic. <laughs> Perhaps I just set my expectations too low. All right. Oh, Mo and Xu Yang. By the way, have you seen Uncle Jean recently? Jean? Oh, a different one. That guy? I remember him saying it was time for him to move on. Ugh. Good for him. I wonder where he's off to next. If you're curious, why don't we go and see for ourselves? <laughs> uh, some other time, perhaps. I'd like to stay here for a while. It's the lantern right again. Wouldn't it be cool if we got to see the lanterns ourselves one day? You can make a wish without a lantern, you know. My mom told me. As long as you yell it really loud, your wish will come true in the future. Yell it? Isn't that kind of embarrassing? As soon as the first person yells, then everyone else just joins in. And nobody feels embarrassed anymore. That's right. Little Wu, you start. All right. I... I wish I could open a massive restaurant with never-ending dishes and snacks so I could enjoy you and chili chicken every day. <laughs> that's your wish? If that's so funny, what's your wish? 
To get rich, of course. Do big business and make a load of Mora. With Mora, you can do whatever you want and be happy. Yeah, if you get rich, you can buy that super expensive toy box. Not just one, one for everyone. No, loads for everyone. Well, if Momo's gonna be a businessman, then I don't need to earn any money. Whoa, 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 it's tough getting rich. Don't put all the pressure on me. As for me, I want to learn to make Ming Xiao lanterns. The big kind! And Xiao lanterns, too. I'll be the best artisan around. Yeah! That way we don't need to go to Liyue Harbor to release Xiao lanterns. Uh, anyway, those are our wishes. Mung, Big G, what about you? Me? Huh? They all disappeared. Right when he was about to make his wish. It brings back so many memories. That was the last lantern ride the five of us spent together. It's been so long. Everyone's all grown up. Have all those wishes really come true? They've come true. We asked each of them for parting gifts for you. Little Wu's become a chef. Momo's a successful businessman. And Tonza makes great shell lanterns. Really? Wow. We've never forgotten our childhood dreams. We've kept them in our hearts as a promise to each other. Anyway, time to release this lantern. Hey, take a hint. Let's give them some space to go over the good old days. I want to know how the kid died. I'm a little morbid, I know, but still. Space, huh? No chance. Wow! There are even the names of all five of us on it! <laughs> Amazing! Oh, didn't you just say that you release lanterns every year? Do you plan to add more names over the years? Like Little Wu's kids and Mumu's wife? Actually, I have some good news. Mumu's soon to be a father. He's been talking about nothing else recently. He's excited and nervous at the same time. <laughs> I wonder if such a goofball will make a good father. No, no, no. You'd be surprised how sharp-witted he is now. Let me tell you. Wow. Uh, same conversation. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> no, no, no. Take the hint? Really? Of all of us, you're the one who needs to learn how to read the room! Your scope of work is nothing like I imagined. Really? The end result is the same, though. Exactly what I do and how I do it are just minor technicalities. As I explained, Wangsheng Funeral Parlor was, once upon a time, more akin to a doctor's office than an actual funeral parlor. During the Archon War, piles of corpses covered the wilderness. People were plunged into misery and suffering. Disease was spreading all over the land. Death devastated the world of the living. Such were the times when the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor was first established. As humans, its founders were deemed too insignificant to matter. But slowly, they managed to drive away death. They must have paid a huge price for that. After generations, Liyue Harbor became a bustling hub of prosperity, luring people with dreams of great fame and abundant mora. But in the end, some lunatics stirred up the legacy of the dead. By that, I mean the remnants of the defeated gods that ravaged the world. I won't go into specifics of that situation, but suffice to say that, at its peak, life was on the verge of bringing about its own extinction, while death was coming back with a vengeance. It took a long, long time, longer than you'd think, to restore balance and reinstate the border. Without it, Liyue Harbor as we know it wouldn't be here today, neither would the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor, you or me. 
Uh, can you reveal a bit more? Not a chance. Oh. Curiosity can be perilous, you know. Don't forget my warning. The less you know, the better. What you make of my words is up to you. I do hope that most of it flew over your heads, though. The Wangsheng Funeral Parlor is just that. A funeral parlor. Nothing more to it. Won't disagree. It's time to go back. We live in peaceful times, but this harmonious coexistence between life and death should never be taken for granted. Huh? It's about time. Let's go. Let's take them to the place where all begins and all goes to rest. What kind of place is that? I just mean where we first bumped into each other. I come up with fun names for things sometimes, okay? No need to hound me with questions about every little thing I say. Well, that was fun. to make you happy, Big G, wouldn't you say? But if you ever really do become an evil spirit and come back with more nefarious nonsense in mind, I may have to forget our friendship and give you a far less fond farewell. I won't, I promise. <sighs> I'm grateful for everything you've done for me. Now that I know that my friends are doing so well, I have no intention to bother them. I also want to thank you. You made my dream come true, too. So you should also mind my warning, Mung. If you won't let go of the past, I might reunite you two sooner than you think. <laughs> How can you say such horrendous things with that smile on your face? <laughs> well then, last but not least, let's say our goodbyes to Big G. See you later, Big G. Not like that. You won't be seeing him later. Let's stick to goodbye and such. <laughs> no worries. I'll just take my leave. I'm sorry. Of all the wishes we yelled that day, only ours hasn't come true. Nah, don't be bothered by that. No life is without its regrets. You can leave in peace now. All right. I'll remember you all. <sighs> Goodbye. He's gone then. I thought that closure would bring me relief, but all I can feel now is emptiness. So, what was the wish you two made? We didn't have a chance to hear it earlier. Well, after each of us has started a family and built a career, we want both our families to spend the lantern right together. That's why I envy my friends so much. Little Wu and the rest, they all had a chance to fulfill their wishes. Mine, however, will remain just a dream. Yeah, cheer up. That's right. Also, think about this. Everyone gets burned to ash one day. So enjoy your life while you can, and when your duty to the living is over, you can meet whoever you want again in the afterlife. Isn't that great? Uh... Thank you? Either way, I don't think I'll ever return to Wuong Hill. I have a lot of feelings to process. No worries. It's a good opportunity for you to go on vacation. Consider your leave approved. Naturally, this doesn't change the terms of our previous agreement. The leave will be unpaid. Promised that you'd help us in our search. I took you to the border and let you have a look around, didn't I? But based on your reaction, it seems like you didn't find what you're looking for. Straight to the point, it's indeed. Pity, indeed. Good business the sense. Pity of all is your lack of help. <laughs> I was fishing around on your behalf through the channels that aren't accessible to you. Unfortunately, I didn't find any leads worth pursuing either. I'll 
I'll keep my eyes open in case anything crops up. If so, I'll be sure to let you know. You don't sound like you mean it. <laughs> I'm not an expert on tracking down the living. However, if you want me to summon someone from the other side of the border... Oh, stop saying creepy stuff! <laughs> Relax. I'll help you look for them. You have my word. Ugh, my exquisite sense of humor always goes unappreciated. Seems like being a funeral home director really suits you. <laughs> I have my reasons. Reasons? The spirits we saw near the border are the dead that still long for the world of the living. But I've never seen any of the previous directors there, not even once. This means that becoming the director of Wangsheng Funeral Parlor was the right decision for them, and left them with no regrets. Be continued. Ooh, we only ten thousand adventure experience to go. I guess I'm going for a fly. I missed a spot. Nice and spicy. Come a little closer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now that you mention it, you got a point there. I knew she wouldn't be there. Good idea to do so. Hmm. Does it get all dark and spooky when I go back up? I think so. What's going on around here?
Again. I wonder why it does that. Hold on a second here. Click here to reload. Back. So strange. Thing I missed. Flowers hanging off the edge. No, I don't have one, honestly. The uh, it's the um, the stream preview window that I'm talking about. Weird. Every once in a while. It just times out or something. I'm not sure. I should look into it because it didn't happen the first few weeks I streamed and then boom, all of a sudden, maybe once a night. The other night I did it twice. Weird shit. Hmm, what's off in this direction? Ruins. What's that? Oh, I remember this. There was stuff in there at one point. I'm one of those weird guys that likes to use uh, I'll catch up. keyboard and mouse for every little damn thing I do. Not sure why. Just kind of always have. Oh, hello. You need to die. For a little shock. It's grand. It's gotta love it. Gotta be something around here I've missed. Never spent a lot of time down here.
Oh, of course there is. Oh, hello. There's a challenge over here. There was? <laughs> oh, well. I'll be back, I'm sure, if I miss anything. It's all good. I'm gonna recover this area and all other areas when, uh, when I get that device. Ooh, fight? Yep. Leave it all to me. Come a little closer. For a little shock, come a little closer. <sighs> All right, where's that uh that thing I saw? I think I saw. Not be able to find it. Ah, there it is. See everything from over here. It's pretty great. I'll catch up. Oh, I remember this. I needed Geo to open up the chest here. Yeah. There's a thing there. Oh, who's that? Squirrel was busy. Oh shit. Have I ever talked to you? I must have. Yeah. Fox <laughs> tail. This guy wants to go for a swim.
<laughs> Come a little closer. Oof. over here. Oh, this spot. It's really good. Good God. I can't get near him to move him. That's hilarious. Yeah, try again, little buddy. That's how you do it. Someone needs assistance. Leave it up. You're in for a little You're in for a little shot. I was already through there. God damn it. Not better. Jeez. Seven of eight here. Should I do Barbara? Where's Barbara? Well, oh, she's around here somewhere. Oh, there she is. this girl up. But I think I'm going for Barbara. Mara. Encore. What's that talent? Max extension five seconds. It's not too bad. can heal with her charged attack. Interesting. I didn't know that. Uh, should I do this or the Geo Bishop? I don't know. I want Hutel, but I also... I was so close with a couple other characters here. Then there's Mona. I think I just ascend right now. And it's also water. 
She's a five star, right? <laughs> Ah, this is the energy recharge girl. That's right. Seven. Six. Six. Everybody else got five or six. What gives? I'm not complaining. Just curious. Ah, oh, then there's Diona. Started level one day, right? Yeah, a little bit. Shinyan, eh, whatever. Ah, oh, so many characters. Not enough everything. Yeah, I do need her. Um, what's that? It's a Q ability, right? Yeah. And I do need another bow user. Is she stuck at 60? Yeah, she's at 60. Uh, I'll at least get her to 40 here. That's alright. What do we got going on? What are these, uh, cryo regis finds? Yeah. Sacrificial. Oh, yeah, the sacrificial bow. That's right. Is that the only one I have? Yeah, at the moment, it's the only one. Oh, yeah, because I already ranked it up to two. That's right. It's right there, and I didn't even read it. Um... Got plenty to rank up with, or uh, level up with. Holy shit. Lots of stuff. Um, and it's got energy recharge on it, that's nice. Does she really have a tail? Have I really never noticed that? And it's a calico tail. Cute. Um, what did I do? Oh, yeah, just opened up this. A cat's ears can hear even the softest footsteps on the ground. Good to know. Footfalls. Everything's calico about her. Nice. Oops. Really, she's the only one? Hey, that's cool. Let's get her on up. Oh, I have on her. 
artifacts. Oh, just a lot of junk. Well, not necessarily, not necessarily junk, just haven't used her in like three weeks. So I was a little low level at that point. Exiles. Everything else is Sojourner. Oh yeah, because of the cryo damage bonus. That's right. Hmm. Maybe I'll go fight some cryo regis finds. I got a nice party for it. Shield ultimate. Yeah. That shield is pretty nice. I gotta say. And it's cute. It's in the shape of a cat's head, if I remember correctly. <laughs> oh, and I only need three to get her up to 60. Yeah, you know what? Let me go on. Head on over there. I gotta spend my dust on something. I got a good party for the Cryo Regis Fine right now. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? I'll fight it once. Where is it? There it is. And I gotta go do those uh, those bi-weekly quests over in Dragon Spine. But then I'll be back. Oh shit. Gotta get him while I'm here. What else I hit? Hmm, I heard something else hit. Weird. Oh, it must have been that. Ouch. These little cuffers. So annoying. Oh, a lot of stuff up here, eh? Oh, he's, he's hiding underground, he thinks. Stop farming. Can't stop, won't stop. Oop, yeah, I will. Get out of the way. <laughs> Steady as stone. I'll catch up. Oh, my God. You're in for a little.
Oh, good. I'll catch up. I must leave no stone unturned. Uh, only two. I was hoping I'd get lucky with the three. Oh well. Alright, now that I've uncapped myself. How many do I have? Only four, so I'm gonna have to wait. Unless, uh... I can find some others hiding around here somewhere. Cause you're right, I only get... I only get five per week. Uh, per set. Right? I think? I don't know. Either way. Um, which direction? This way. Oh yeah, goulash. To the chasm. Possible. I gotta check something here real quick, just for curios curiosity's sake. Let's see if these foxes are still around. <laughs> No, not that I can see. Oh, even the food bowl is gone. Oh, that's unfortunate. I'll catch up. No, that's all right.
Oh shit. It was my honor. Might have been uh, smart to pay attention to my stamina. That happens far too frequently. Oh boy. the thing. This way. Oops. Just missed the weasel. They blend in too well. Oh shit. I just remembered something. I gotta... Do a quick check in. Oh, crap, lock me up. This one, another time trial. Need to warm up somewhere. There we go. Yeah. All right, top of the thing. There's a bro up here. Two bros. Split. 
flush. Where's the other dude? teleport. I don't like it. Probably upstairs, right? Yep. Not right by the teleport. How far up? Eh, that's not too bad. Just hoof it. Stamina. I wish there was a food that would increase stamina rather than. Ah, screw it. You know what? I'll use some of the other stamina food. Where is it? Yeah, it's this stuff, right? Nope. Oh. Hmm, I wonder if it works for climbing. Tell. Doesn't look like it. Come a little closer. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Blip. Ah, there he is. Browns. Hmm. Really wonder if there's just one. Ouch. One more crimson, whatever they're called in here, that I could pick up. I think I got them all. Wait, this. What's it called? Crimson egg. Gotta be another one hidden somewhere that I didn't pick up. I hate being stuck one behind after I pick up all my uh, bi-weekly rewards here. Oh yeah, there's the... Uh, I remember this place. Yeah. One more quest, I'll have nine. Ugh. Tragic. Um, uh, this one. I just want to kill us. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Surrender and it will be gentle. Wind blade. That made it easy. Oh, I got a purple wick, wick, mist grass. shouldn't have said anything. I wouldn't have known it was there.
we'll uh, try to be wearing off soon. Yeah. I might have to spend some time looking around the mountain just to see if there's anything I can find. Gotta be, right? Couldn't have gotten everything. Come a little closer. Closer. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. <laughs> Wind blade. I must leave no stone unturned. Uh, Noel is easily my most powerful character right now. Well, at least rivaling the main character. That is. In terms of raw damage, I guess. Maybe not in like overload or whatever. Oh, look at this outcrop. Love it. Got all but this one over here. of investigate points. Not bad. Ah, shit. Bold. Forgot about that. Try something. Pop on up to the top here. Just choose a direction and Is there time for a quick look snack? down. I'll whip one up in no time. See if I see anything. Since I'm here, you're in for a little shock. Boba, get them! You're I forgot how much they can hurt. Come a little at the frying pan. Huh. I must leave no at the frying pan. You're in for a little shock. <sighs> Try not to enjoy that. Yeah. 
Hmm. Fire? Fire. <laughs> Love that shit. Yeah, look at that. Nine. Ugh. Oh well. Hey, you're back already? I sworn I already killed that guy. And his friend. Friends. But I guess they like other enemies in this game. You leave the area and boom, they come back. Game, there's got to be one I missed. Somewhere just floating around in some odd spot. where I already been, where I'm not, I don't know. Just looking to get somewhere warm real quick. If it's next to a shooty boy, no problem. Yep, that's a shooty boy. Oh, strange tooth. There you go. Good thing I did this. Oh, wrong thing. tooth that could spawn there. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. Oh, there's a chest. That I never saw. Unbelievable. Unfortunately, it's not glowing. As a beautiful maid would. This isn't good. 
I stop though? me that time, buddy. Oh, I'm gonna drown. Set there. There's something up in the sky that I don't know about. Probably already got it, whatever it was. That looks cool. <gasps> nah, there shouldn't be anything up in the sky. see without the space of course hmm possible be down around here somewhere. Alright, uh, actually a little, a little further over. There's the point. So like straight down. Right about there. I'll check it out. Oh, forgot to name it something, right? <laughs> to me, all of it, whatever it is. What exactly is it? I didn't quite catch your request. Uh, let's see. Let me just pick this up. Let's see what's closest. It does seem familiar, though. Ah, oh, I'll head on over. That is a, one of the places I have run around in the least, that's for sure, on this mountain. It's not glowing, but I'm going to get it. I must leave no stone in the Well, an anima boy, huh? Nice 
fucking blade. You can't run. Well, I will end you. Come a little closer. You've been a naughty boy. Yeah, it doesn't do shit. Oh well. Should have just put a nice somebody in my party. Oh well. This isn't good. Add the frying pan into the fire. Race you. I'll catch up. I think I've already found it. I don't know. I'll catch up. Oh, climb, baby. There you go. That's the thing, I, uh, I really didn't do a whole lot of, oh, I do remember this, there's this weird ass thing that I've seen a bunch of times here, not sure what that is. Leading me to here. Maybe Someone something. Existence. Maybe nothing. Uh. Oh. I'll catch up. I'll catch up. Someone needs assistance. Someone needs assistance. Well, that's cool. No crimson agate in it, though. Ooh, what's that? Where's the red rock for that? Whatever that is. Wait, do I even need it? I think I do. I must leave no stone unturned. Hmm. Well, regardless of whether there's a uh, an agate in there, I want it. some star silver up on that
wonder if it's another one of those pick up the pick up the uh, the buff and then fly over from the top and then jump down I don't know oh, a red rock up here shit I want to do. Oh my god. Someone needs assistance. Ah, there's a thing. Oh, and it's by other Someone things. Assistance. Oh, at the very least, I'm picking up a nice sum of star silver. Probably. Oops. Let me note that. Whenever you need me, I'll be there. I'll catch up. up a little. I think I've been to the top of this thing. Never hurts to check. Unless I die doing it. Oh, 
Oh, that was you for me. Check, uh... that freaking island that I hated with the time trial on it I remember that much Hello there. Steady as stone. You don't like fire, do you? Come a little closer. You come a little closer. You come a little closer. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. You're in for a little shock. Wind blade. Stay on the ground. Oh, uh, no purple. That's all right. <laughs> Dang it, I want you. There we go. current situation. Huh. I'll catch up. Someone needs assistance. Well, just gotta sub someone else in real quick. Oh, I'm looking Get 
you're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. <laughs> You're in for a little sh Come a little sh Get the You need to hurry up. Always one of them I forget about. Or we'll have the wrong party composition for. Come on. You're in for a little shock. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. That's better. First off, and another dragon tooth. Strange tooth. I think I have three, right? Can I just do three? Nah. Gotta do four at a time. But. Let me check out this area up in here a little bit. Like, uh, maybe in the cave, the, uh, I forget what it's called. Cause that's, uh, that's one place I don't think I've gone through all that much, but I think I have. I don't know, it's a good question. Hard to know. Take a quick little float over here. Huh. 
Dodge this! Ha! Nice and spicy! You're too! That's a quick jump in this way. I think I was already over here. Was I not? I don't know. Happy to pick up more star silver on the way, though. Oh, yeah, I don't have that. No L in the party anymore. No, do. for a little shot. the shield up. I think it still hits me, but that is hard? I don't know. Forget. a big boy over there.
its assistance. What was that? I'll catch up. Is that an icicle on top of an icicle here? Kind of hilarious. Someone needs assistance. Yep, yeah, there's a secret door. get up for a minute or two stretch my legs grab something new to drink here I'll be back in two minutes hadn't even realized it's over three hours into the stream holy shit all right dear other Ah, okay, man. Good seeing you. Hope to see you later. If not, maybe tomorrow. All right. Let's get back into this. I gotta find one more. something. I'm out of, uh, goulash. Huh. <laughs> 
think I got them all. Dang. If I didn't, I don't know where else to get them. Leave it all to me. Boba, get them. You're in for a little shock. All right, they're a big shock. That's what I say. even stretches like a kitty. That's great. Adventure rank 4669. Still 10,000 to go, basically. 9,800. Oh well. Just a wee bit of food of some sort. Good, great. Defense. Leave it at the fry pan. Surrendering will be gentle. Come a little closer. Well, that was quick. Nice five star. Hey, Diona. Kitty committee. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
all right. I could get pretty close to getting her up again. What about her weapon? Gotta hit confirm. Yeah, sure. Well, it is technically still Friday for me. Do a couple of these. Like, uh, what's her name? Don't disappear, lady. You do that far too often. I'll catch up. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. Come a little closer. As a good night should. I must leave no stone unturned. I'm the bright man. <laughs> Love to help. I mean, why not? If I switch me up now. Uh, this will be interesting. Out. That's epic. Let's see what happens. Freeze! Oh, 
so sorry. With the wind! Cool it. Nice and spicy. Let's spark things up a little. I got to do it again. Oh, no health. They call me No Health McGee. Oops. They call me Wait a Minute McGee. <clears throat> Time for a snack. for a little shock. Let's spark things up a little. <laughs> Freeze! Ah. 
Don't get frostbite. for a little shock. <laughs> Come a little closer. Oh, my going out is tiring. Freeze. This moment will be frozen. <laughs> When did she have her PP slapped? I didn't see it. Orange? Nope, of course not. Not even a purple? God damn it, game. it does that. Oh, it didn't add the crystals. Interesting. I'm glad it didn't. We'll have to get this shit out of my inventory. Oh, uh, no. That's not what I want to do. Well, I am actually out of greens. Huh.
Miss Edith. Alright, head on back to Cryo Registrar. 
one more kill should do. Oh, but not you. You won't do. Yeah, very exciting. I agree. Leave it on to me. Nice and spicy. Come a little closer. Come a little closer. Come a little closer. <laughs> for a little shot. Closer. Nice and quick. Come a little closer. You, you. Up, come a little. Wind blade. <laughs> You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. No ho. <laughs> Up there, eh? Walky <laughs> doggy.
Someone needs assistance. Alright, gonna go on a quick artifact hunt. And then I gotta go. Go to loop here, that is. Birdies now. Don't leave me. for a little shot. One of these days. Yep, no. Eat my bow is dick. Steady as stone. I'm the frying pan. 
You're in for a little shock. <laughs> Well, shit. Look at that. Guess it's right there. Never seen it before. Unbelievable. My life. What am I doing with it? Chilies. And I think that'll do. I'll catch up. We need some Valberries. It's gonna have to wait for another day. I got other games to play. Can't help myself. <laughs> Turn to a million. Thank you. Picked up in that corner up here. Guess I didn't have to. <laughs> I 
Another test subject. Okay, you can call me a test subject all you want. And I'm stuck in a tent. God, the range on this sword. Love it. Just go home, start something. I can do a batch. I I can do a batch. Yeah, why not? Alright. Are the birdies back, or did I scare them away for the day? Yeah, looks like they're gone for the day. That's unfortunate. From now I know. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna get a nice stretch in here. Okay. Switching on over. To Lupiro. off here. Doing everything, that's what. Um, have not tried chapter four yet. 
Let's see. What? Just to warm up, let me do chapter two with. I've never seen what Arsenal does for the uh, Necromancer. Curious. And I don't know how a river works. I've never used river. So, that's what I'm doing first. Yeah. What's it give me? A shield, eh? Well, that sucks. Could have given me a better book. Or a different... something. Unreal. Well, that's alright. Hopefully... Oh my god. They're so far away. And I don't know why. How does this work? Oh, it only goes... Oh, well that's weird. Now I want to start over. Shit. How many rivers can I have? All the way around? Must be, right? Need more rivers, please. Oh, this could be weird. Is that one? Cause it's got something next to it. Interesting. Max skeleton, sure. Village. Maybe early. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe so. Maybe not. A little early. <clears throat> oh, I should do forest tiles only around that side. Need more river tiles. Qualitize. Seems like it nerfs more than 15%. Oh no. Oh, I see how it's going here. Corner tiles. Other things. Thank you. 
I knew now what I knew then. I wish I knew then what I knew now. I don't know what I know. Finally a ring. Battlefield. Didn't see him. Attack speed. I'll get attack speed for my other things. Um, I think I'll do right there before the boss. I can't wait. Any longer, gonna get this in. Oh, bandit banditos. Space banditos. Need a lot more tiles, game. Another battlefield, that'll help. Oblivion, please. Same. Max skeletons. Yes. putting certain things here with the river, how it is. please. That's not river. I might have to get rid of the deserts and the dunes, the dunes, the dunes. What grove? There we go. Kitchen knife. What does that do again? HP for every food item placed in my camp. 
Vamp Mansion. It's still kind of early. Smart. Now I got more shit to oblivion. Ooh, the ring. Um, it's not really better. So maybe my spider level or uh, spider level, skelly level. Um. Could be better. Oh, an oblivion, good. There's something I need to get rid of. Right away. Campo El Bandido. the extra skeleton, right? Yeah, so... Oh no, where's the, uh... Oh yeah, that's right, I just got rid of it. Alright. Help game. The shield right there. More skellies. Um, 
versus lost defense. Oh, try it. Where are all my rivers? Village, huh? Don't mind if I do. Hey, there's a river. Too bad there's no Phoenix. Enough blacksmiths. That's what I'm talking about. Blood clot, though. That helps. That don't. Oh, that might be something to look at there. at it. Didn't see anything I liked. That's okay. The river, the river. Max. I think so. I think so. Quality versus max HP. Yes. 
I want to say yes, but I don't know if it's a yes. Attack speed already. Oh, an oblivion, huh? Hmm. more quality. I really need a ring that I'm looking for. Something with skeleton level or quality on it. Oh, it hurts, game. It hurts a lot. But, that is the ways of the roguelite. Just happy to see a loot balloon. That might be more what I'm talking about. Although, what's this? the answer? I don't know. Not sure what I'm going for at the moment, but I'm going for it. Quick fail. suppose I could pop one of these in, but I don't want to. Need more frickin' rivers. That's all I can do? Oh, I get it. I should have put that lengthwise then. I thought I could ring the whole thing. Oh, that sucks. Or maybe I can. I don't know. We'll see.
So, this could be a bust. level 6. Let's go to level not even 4. Ugh. Seems to be doing alright though. That's a loop balloon. Oh crap, am I gonna get stopped there? I don't know, let's see. I think I will. Okay. Probably have only one river. Whatever length it be. In which case I planned poorly, because this is the first time I ever used rivers, and that's all right. It's not what I wanted. I wanted that. Okay, I gotta use the oblivion now. It's gonna get pushed off the edge. I got a test. Need more rivers. I got a test. like that's going to be the end of my river. Well, shit.
kind of gets my skeleton level where it needs to be. Kind of. But hardly. Uh... What does that do? Passing a campfire with max speed to a uh, base now. Hmm. I don't think I like that. Looking for more river, but that's all right. Let's see now. Nope. Invasion. They're a little less level. Um. I mean, ugh, excuse me. That's a big chunk of evasion. Okay, can I put it down? That's the question. I can't. It starts and it ends. Okay. Good to know. I did not know that. So I kind of screwed the pooch there, but it wasn't my fault. Some wheat. Oblivion, eh? the heel down yet. level. That's alright though. Where am I? Okay, I think it's time to put the village in. Oh, I had to go right there, didn't it? That's alright. I don't think they'll spawn before I get there. If they do, oh my. Oh, 
Oh, my summon quality is so poor. Is there anything I can do about that? Doesn't look like it. And I can add point or uh, one percent. Not worth. Probably getting slapped. Oops. Nice hits, nice hits. Keep it up, guys. to the, uh, the Count's chair. I had a Count's chair. Weird. I didn't notice it go away. That's alright. I think. Ah, so I can do some upgrading, eh? What would I like to upgrade? Hero Strength? Good question. Wow, I'm almost out of metals. It's stable metal, right? Stable metal. Uh, maybe I shouldn't do the war camp just yet. What's level one that still needs to be upgraded? The gym. What does that do if I upgrade? Unlocks a town card. Town card? Oh, I need to do that. Can I synthesize one of these? One of those. One of these and one of those. Let's see. Uh, nope. I can't. Well, shit. Oh, a farm and we will go. A farm and we will go. I hold a Dario. A farm and we will go. Wait. Um, do I? Sure. That seems important. Now what does doing a mud hut do for me? Oh, camp item slots. Or is that just... I'm still a little confused about certain things. More houses. Sure. No 
build another. And I shall supply further. Okay, I did go to Count's chair. Interesting. Oak bed? No, I don't like the sound of it. Or HP. More heals. More regen. Okay, you know what? I think I'll do a rogue. Nah. More HP for now. But I think I am gonna play three. The rogue. No, you know what? Let me see what, uh. But Act 4 is like with the Rogie Rogue. Hmm, is there something I want to get rid of? Actually, let's go Necro. Don't really like the outpost. Oh, no wonder I wasn't getting any treasuries. I didn't have an active. Whoops. <sighs> Yawn. Wow, why am I so tired? Got a lot of sleep. Um. It's every two days. Once a day. Alright. Try and do the river correctly this time. Just start me with a ring, a necklace, and a book, not two books. Either way. Start here and make my way around, I think. Out of here, actually. and sand dunes can go over here and I'm close to but kind of in the middle yeah I think I like that hmm 
Hmm, I'd love to use a blood grove, but I can't. could really use stuff to put next to. Well, that bad's all failed. Come on, game. Help me out, bro. That's not anything I want to do. Thanks, though. Forest. start putting forward uh, putting forests in wait what is this oh boy sub bosses That's what I'm talking about. So, 11, this should be 14, 15, should be 15 now. Yeah, okay. Screw it, you're going there. Here's a village. Hello. Level over quality.
finally a village. Um, Five, thirty-six, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. Well, that's how we're doing it. Right in the middle. I don't think I need to vamp it out. If I get another village, I'll do that one. Oh, but the timing. The timing is right. Yeah, that, was, that was a terrible place for a village. Gonna have to wait. Hopefully I get a new one soon. What does this mean? out soon. Oh no, do I have to fight? First boss guy. Slightly better because of quality, though. Figures, this guy. Oh my god! Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, jeez. My lord. I should have known. I wonder if he could spawn two bosses at once. What happens then? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh my god. 45% in. Oh my god, they're not fucking around. Holy shit, bitch. Whoa. Whoa, I would have put vampire mansions all around if I'd known. Oh crap. Down to 40. Increase the range like that. Holy shit. I don't even have a level yet. Oh, I do. Now. Yeah. 
I'm not prepared. Hey, loot balloon. Big level up, big attack speed up, big, big book. Got that in, thank God. Oh shit, it was that one I wanted to get rid of. Oh fuck. Well, at least I got rid of one. another oblivion soon nope that's no oblivion one chance. I'm gonna need this ASAP if I survive. Uh oh. Give me big boy, please. Doesn't matter, he's dead. Turn him down, come on, baby. There we go. Speed down is all right, and I'm almost spawning the next guy. Unbelievable! There's so many things I need right about now. That's one of them.
Not better. Only the lich. So if I want to build here, I gotta destroy his bullshit. Oh god, I didn't know it was gonna be so heavy. Ouch. I wonder if that affects his boys. Good question, I tell you. Good, good question. Okay, now give me something to put next to that river. That's nothing. Steal my shit. He stole my ring. Are you fucking kidding me? Alright. Fucking game. hit six. Alright, it's a level five. Not bad. Still, it's a bullshit game. Bullshit. Give me something to put against those rivers. Please? Only at 55 attack speed. God damn it, game. It's going to be a fun fight. At least they're attacking the loot balloon first. Not better. Not better. Not better. Nothing better.
Uy. I'm so sorry. And we're about to find out whether the palaces affect anyone other than Lich Boy. Should I force the fight now? Should I go around again? Hope for more loot. There's one loot balloon. But there's also this ass fucker. Going around. One more time. Ooh, an oblivion, eh? Mm, can't oblivion that yet. Sucks balls. It's shit RNG. Well, let's see. Is this the cutoff version? Hungry Grove, yeah. Let's put a regular grove in there then. Spawn the boss. Ooh. Two clots. This sucks. Um, skelly level down slightly. I don't want to drop below six. Skelly level up. Quality down. It's quality, but it drops a level precipitously. Oof. Not finding anything I need. Ouch. Well, let's see what happens anyway. Oh, I got another village card. Ghosts are evasive, it turns out. Oh, such shitty gear. Um, village. I'm gonna need that right about there. River Bro. If only I could fill it out. To the now. Man, I'm getting shit gear. Uh, no, I don't want to add more river yet. Man, I got a few.
Get him. Boop balloon. And slap him. Thank you. Oh my. There's something. Six point eight eight. Better than nothing. This could give me quality. Drop me down to six again. It might actually be worth it. What else do we have here, though? Ugh. Need an amulet with freaking skelly stuff on it. Why are these even a thing? Well, evasion could be nice. Um. Can I drop for quality? It's a balance. Balance says yes. Anything fun? I want to say yes, but I don't want to. Oh god. Don't take my gear. Kill him quick. Assless chaps. I'm probably dead right here. Oh shit. Well, maybe uh, attack the same guy. Fellas, please. Doesn't matter which one, just attack the same guy. Where is that? Bandit camp. I didn't even see that. Son of a bitch. Why did it even spawn? Well, at least they didn't steal my shit. Hmm.
I don't want to lose quality or level. But I need that HP. Damn it. And that's beefy HP right there. Really need to level up. That's all right. And I'm out of Cheerios. Shit. Let's see. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. Actually. Oh no, that's quality shit. Can't drop quality. I can't. Can't. Oh boy. Skelebros. This could work out. It's a lot of level right there. Think about it. Ooh. Do this and this. This is fine. About the same. Lord, no. Anything I'd like to oblivion. Uh, yes, there is something I'd like to oblivion. Bandit camp, Red Arena. Do I take it or do I not? I need the magic HP. Especially against this girl coming up at E. I think I just gotta go for it.
Bar River. Do I equip this? I think I do. Let's go. Okay. She does not get buffs from... What's his name? The Lich. That's good. Come on, punch through that shield. Potion. Come on, you got her. Get through her. Thank you. Oof. Scary shit. I need river, bro. Okay, thickets are nice, but I need that river to go with it. Should I pump attack speed? Nah, I can't. My rivers. Oh, 
What is this? Where did he come from? I mean, I'll take him, but I don't know where he came from. Oh, because I have Max. Oh, Max. Oh. Okay. That's pretty cool. Full health already. Why no river cards? I don't get it. Just a straight up necklace. All right. And a ring. There's a skeleton level on it. Skellies. Max skeleton. Max skeleton. Three max skeletons. Four max skeletons. Max six. Okay. Does gear drop later on that has more? Because I don't know how you're supposed to get up to ten. Yeah. I'm only holding out.
I don't start getting more river. Kind of screwed. I need all the river, all the now. So it has max skeleton and skeleton skeleton no actually this could be good Well, 139 attack speed. Wish me luck. I think I'm dead. It's only the second time I've even seen this boss. Woof. I got him. It's looking pretty good already. Slapped his peepee. -pee. Kill the doggy. Doggies. Please. Thank you. Looks that they phase away, but that's how I was able to kill the boss so easily.
River. I'm scared. Doesn't have max skellies on it, I can't take it. I can't go down in skeleton level, especially fifty four percent. Or 54. Alright, that would take me down to 7.44 now. I can't do it. Oof. An explosion. my rivers. Oof. Love an oblivion for these spots. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I really would love an oblivion. Love to put in another village in. That's fantastic. Oh. 
just leveled up. Okay. Maybe I'll get another level. Oblivion for me, please. Just one. That's all I need. Just one. again. Give me shit I can build. Just 500 health. Loot balloon. Get the loot balloon, dudes. Please, before it gets me. Come on, man. River, good. Ooh. Let's see. Max Skillabro, right there. Skelly level way down. Quality level. Mm. Okay, let's see. 6.92. Damn. Mm. This hurts. None of this is good. Keep me under. Oh, well, let's see. Okay, the book. 
lose a skeleton. Six point nine two. That would give me fifty six more. Minus eight. Forty six. Bring me down to seven point four six. myself there. I think I just went backwards. How did I do the math wrong? Oh, whatever the case. Still have 150% pack speed. Do I dare? I think I dare. I'll be up over 500 for the boss if I can spawn him, which I won't. Unless the game gives me what I need, which it's kind of doing. Kill the loop balloon. Balloon gave me nothing. Shit. Where am I? God damn it, I'm gonna have to go around again. Oh, I don't wanna have to go around again. Got a pee. <laughs> and I simply can't pull a fucking oblivion out of my hat, can I? Oh, well, I can't put any more desert in. this reflect the dead loot balloon here we go this will help right now I get an oblivion it's alright I just got a village too okay on village need another oblivion Oof.
Wow. Same ring as the level 9. Okay, that's garbage. Eight point four seven, okay. Better skeletons, but I'll lose one. I can't lose one. Okay. Water and forest. Or an oblivion. Thank you. Sub loot balloon. Blue loot balloon. Hey, an oblivion. Alright. I needed that. Nope. Which one? This one? Can't see. Yes, that one. Uh, let's see, is there anything good here? Nope. Nope. Oh, hell no. Give me forests and rivers. Only forests and rivers. It doesn't do anything for me. There. Shit, where am I? Oh my god, I'm halfway around. I need to spawn this boss now. Give me a river, bitch. That's not a river. That could be a nice ring. It's got max skellies on it. 
Okay. 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 Spider Bros tearing me up. Not that bad. Oh my god, game, give me river. Ugh, I don't want to put anything down other than river. <laughs> or forest. Not cooperating. Maybe I should have taken a desert out. There we go. 166 attack speed. River. More river, fuck yes. Eleven? Nope. Let's fucking spawn him. Nope. Wow, oh, there he goes.
See you right back. See you, fatty buddy. Let's see, what time is it? Three in the morning. I'll give it to 3.25 a.m. my time. Let's see what happens. Anybody want to watch this shit? I want to watch this shit. I want to see it happen. Anybody? It's time to face the destiny of this world. Blah, 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 blah.
y'all are missing. Waiting on anybody. One person. I don't know if I'm gonna beat him. Never beaten him before. Never never even fought him before. Y'all got seven fucking minutes. I'm gonna check the weather. While I wait on my phone. It's minus one degree C. It sucks. Oh, minus, minus two degrees C. My bad. What's this hybrid? Weird. Soon. I don't want to show up for this shit. It's gonna be sweet. Ooh, it's gonna be sixty three. It's coming Thursday. Nice. Check the weather. Nobody's in here yet. 
You've got four minutes. Just need one viewer. One viewer. Besides me. Ah, Coca-Cola. I love you. <laughs> Come on, people, let's do it. We're all my viewers from the other night. <laughs> hey man, I'm about to pull, pull the final boss of this game, but no one else is showing up. <laughs> I figured I'd wait another couple of minutes to see if anybody wanted to see it. Yeah, I've never fought him before, so it should be interesting. My character's right here. I got a little town heel right there, and there's the boss. I'm just going to give it a couple more minutes. Eh, one more minute. It's 3.29 a.m. here. Once it hits 3.30, I'm doing it. I just wanted to see if anybody would pop in. I changed my title. Maybe get a little more viewership, but I don't know. Doesn't look like it's happening. Stream or uh, click baiting almost. But there's so many people playing this game right now. Some people have like 6,000 people in their room. Little old me right here. All right, just turned to 3:30, and I want to do this. Well, here we go. Yeah, it's, it just came out yesterday, so... Alright, I can't believe it. Are you really God? The one that created everything? Yes and no. Once upon a time, my transformation started here. Hear me out. Wait, you want to explain everything before you kill me? Exterminate. It's not the same. Although for consciousness and personality created by it, there's not much of a difference, I guess. I don't want just to explain, but to be explained. There's no actual sense in it, but maybe you'll help me understand something that I can't. I will listen closely. I was Alpha, the beginning and creator of all. I created everything because I was God of creation. And life, and all of its variety and relativity, I liked the most. And you humans are my favorite among all living beings. I've adopted the form of a human and manifested myself to humans in countless worlds. To look at my creation and to feel joy from it. But it was here, in the heart of the world, part of a world filled with different creatures, teeming with life and struggle, where I was met not as a creator, but as a threat. It's a little Bible related, yep. A man covered his family from my light as if it was searing flame. He had a spear in his hands. And he tried to kill me. The spear didn't do me any harm. 
It was just it was still just the atoms I created, scattered and reorganized. The matter I created poses no threat. It traveled through space and hit not my body, but emptiness. But that impulse. I was more surprised than ever before. I was puzzled. The magnificence of that moment, the defiance of your creator, the will to live and keep living. A small triumph of life completely independent of me, so pure and self-sustained, going against the will of its creator. Only a small moment of excitement, and I let the spear pierce my chest. I died, and I didn't die. At the center of all creation, a new me was born, new and eternal. I was striving not to create, but to return everything to nothingness, as it was before. A desire born from denial of my old intention, pointless creation was replaced by pointless destruction. Whoop. You allowed yourself to be killed, but why? I think it was out of compassion. I wish to give my killer what he desired. But why won't you show compassion now? What's the point of complete emptiness, of non-existence? Leave at least some of it to, the, to us, to survivors. You were created, so you won't be able to understand. Why does existence and being have any meaning for you? Why is emptiness not perfect for you? I am obsessed with the idea of reducing everything to nothing. The absence of existence seemed absolutely right to me. It's ideal. I can't agree with you. Your servants couldn't destroy this place. That means that I have a chance. Even if this is all that's left to protect. You're not him, although you are closer to him than anyone else. That's why you are still here. You are closest relative of the man who was holding that spear all those ages ago. Oh, I get it. You're just a tiny bit of the memory of my birth, a display of sentimentality that I've acquired along with the human form. A deeply personal little piece of the world that I want to destroy with my own hands. Knowingly or not, I guarded you against my own disciples. That's how you survived. I'm actually interested in what may become of all this. Be brave, I will give you a chance to defend your world, because that would be right. I shall protect the right of this world to live. Look at me and you'll see no doubt in my heart. Alright. Oh, there goes all my gear. Oh, he's tough. What does he do? Cosmic has a soul. I am. Destroys all cards and items at the end. Oh, at the start of battle. Every third attack erases one item of the one of the hero style. Oh god. Yeah, my shit's going away. And yeah, it's coming back. Okay. I'm, I'm damaging him a little bit. Luckily, I don't have to do anything. Eh? It's hands off at this point. I don't have to touch a button. Nothing. My skeletons just have to kill. Or be killed. And I have uh, six potions. That might help. Ouch. Oh, no, I'm getting screwed here. Wonder what it takes to beat this boss, then. As long as I can keep summoning skeletons... No. Crap, this ain't happening. There's a resurrection. But I think he's still gonna kill me. Yep, and there you go. Ooh, I can resurrect. Hmm. Yeah, the power of friendship. Tell you about. Um, I'm gonna resurrect. I get one free resurrection. It might be enough. It 
just might be enough. Probably not. Because when he hits me hard, he hits me. Yep, like right there. Oof. But, still possible. It all depends on my attack speed. Don't think it's going to be enough. But I don't know. It might be. Hold on. Here we go. I just got to get him down to... Nope. I'm dead. Ah, crap. He hit me hard. Right at the end there. That last hit. If I could have gotten through that. It's probably my evasion stat. Uh, I'm going to use... Wow. Four boss tokens to collect all my earnings. Crap! Oh, well. Let me, uh... Let me change my... title again. Alright. Well, that was close. I wonder what I'm going to need to do to beat him. There's plenty of stuff I can do. As you can see, I can upgrade a bunch of buildings here, which could help. Um, there was something I wanted to upgrade, and I don't remember what it is. Was it War Camp? No. Although that would be a good one. Um... Um, no. Oof. So far away from that. Oh, I think it was the gym. Yeah, I wanna... I wanna upgrade the gymnasium. But it unlocks the town card. It's a card I don't have yet. Yeah, this is a, this, this is a crazy game. Um, that was Act 4. As you can see, I beat all the other guys. Um, but yeah, here's your, here's your deck building part of the game. Uh, maybe... Nah, I gotta keep the desert in. I was thinking maybe I should get rid of it, but I gotta keep it. Smith's Forge really helped. This gives me a 20% damage negation buff. Ancestral Crypt, I wonder if I should have maybe taken Arsenal. Nah. Well, possibly. I don't know. If I take Arsenal, then I gotta get rid of Desert. Because Desert lowers your HP, but it also lowers the boss's HP. No, I didn't win. I got really close. So close. Um, he only had about 5% health left, but he hit me really hard right at the end. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and start up a new run. See if I can actually beat him this time. Uh, but it could be a long run, to say the least. Um, oh, there's something else I got to do. You can also give your give your boys supplies. Ooh, that's what I want to do. I want to build a couple of farms. No, not farms. Mud huts. There we go. One more mud hut. Build another mud hut. Um, and there's a town building building aspect as well. It's pretty neat. I don't know. I love this shit. It's kind of crazy. 
But I will put another farm in because I'm losing spots here. There we go. Now I can supply more shit. Got three more slots for supplies. Uh, HP after killing an enemy. That won't help. I actually used to, yes. Um, back in the day, probably five or six years ago now when it first came out, right? Or maybe longer ago. I don't even know how long it's been. It's been a while, though. I enjoyed it. Spent some money on that game, too. Frying pan, huh? Yeah, it was a good time. I forgot why I stopped playing it. Okay, I'm full up again. Oh wait, should I have done that? Uh, this is what I should have put in. Um, let's see. There we go. Yeah, that looks better. Okay. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna give it another shot. Same character. I also have, uh... I could also try with a warrior class, or I could try with a rogue. But I've had some nice success with, uh, with the warlock or whatever it's called here. Uh, necromancer? Yeah, necromancer. Start. This is what it looks like at the beginning. And then your, uh, your character just slowly meanders around the, uh, the set path here. You know, this is a tough... Uh, it's not that tough. But yeah, there's my ancestral crypt. This is called a gold card. You only get one of them per per game here. Um, I'll put that right in the middle. There you go. This will give me three maximum HP for every enemy killed that has a soul. Yeah, good times. All right some gear and then you just let them walk right into the fights it's pretty wild oh that's a nice book starts off really slow but that's all right. Okay, so let me see if I start my river right here. And I should put this start right about there. It's got all sorts of strategic building things. I don't know what to call it. Ooh, a ring. Ooh, spiders. Then you place down tiles that spawn monsters, and the monsters give you more loot. What I'm looking for is a river and forest, mainly. Ah, there's the river. So let's see, I want to start it right about there and go all the way around in that direction. Up to the top and then back down the side. 
think that'll do. The river doubles the effects of whatever card you put next to it. I'm looking for... Uh, I'm looking for forest cards because they increase my attack speed and attack speed increases the speed at which you can summon your uh, your skeletons. Vampire Mansion is fun. If you put that next to a town, he invades the town. Spawns a whole bunch of, bunch of monsters. Good times. But I don't have any towns at the moment. Which kind of sucks. All right, spiders. Ah, uh, skeleton level. I think that's better than attack speed, because I'll be getting a lot of attack speed from my build. So I want to pump up the level of my spiders. Blood Grove. Nowhere to use that yet. It's a weird game, but once you get the feel for it, it's really fun. But I don't expect you to stick around if this ain't your thing. You know, it ain't your thing. Uh, better, better necklace. There's some more forest. That's what I'm talking about. That right there. get even better forest. Nice. Oh, they keep giving me thickets. Oh yeah, it's very unique. I've never played anything like it. Um, there's a lot like it, but nothing like it. If that makes any sense. It doesn't make any sense, I know. Sorry about that. Um, let's see, these... First get this down. These battlefields are great. They spawn a chest. A loot chest at the beginning of your run. And I'll admit, I'm not usually into games with cheesy graphics like this. But for some reason it works. Ooh, here's a village. Okay, check this shit out. I'm gonna pop a village down. The village heals you when you pass through it. I'm gonna put a couple of wheat fields around it. And that'll heal me even more. But I'm gonna also put a vampire mansion next to it. And it's gonna, uh... It's gonna fill. It's gonna turn the village into a ransacked village. Spawns up. Spawns up to four ghouls once per loop. It always spawns four, uh, no matter what they say in the tooltip. But after three full loops, it'll turn into a better village. 
that heals you for like 150, 160 damage. It's pretty cool. Uh, you just have to get there. And of course you gotta fight the vampire as well. And as you can see, he hurts. Ooh, that's nice. Big book right there. Actually, it's good enough to equip right away. Tough fight. It should pay off, though. Oh yeah, and he spawns bats under 50% health. Wow, tough fight. Hey, but I got a forest. Love it. Ah, Smith's Forge. So Smith's Forge will buff my character for uh, for trading in. Uh, gear as you pass by it. Every time I pass one of those blue tiles, it'll give me a buff. Good times. And sometimes he spawns a uh, an enemy as well. Yep, there you go. Spawn an enemy. Every time you give him six pieces of loot. Silver pendant, what is that? Minus four damage from all vampires. So if I equip that in my uh, my supply menu outside of the, the run, I'll take less damage from vampires. Good times. Crazy game. As you can see, it's starting to fill up with enemies. Love it. I need to kill everything. Oh, that's a level 2 ring sitting there. Oh, and I just gained a level, so I get a perk. 20% um, chance to exceed the number of skeletons and summon two of them instead. That sounds good. Uh, better necklace? Yes. Not a better ring. No wonder I didn't put it on. Alright. Yeah, called, that's why they call it Loop Hero. Absolutely. All you do is go around in circles. That's half the fun, though. Uh, let's see. I'm going to be putting this around here, then here. That's going to be my max limit for this, I think. Yeah. Ooh, spiders are kicking my ass. Uh, let's see, maybe I'll put a Smith's Forge here. Get another buff halfway through the run. Uh, skeleton down, max skeleton up. I don't really have enough attack speed for this to come into play yet. That's alright. Uh, up here, you can see this, uh, this boss bar. Every, okay, first off, every day that passes, this, uh, this bar will fill. Every day that passes, you get a little heal at the end of it and see you spawn monsters. Um, but this boss bar right here, it's, well, in the final chapter, it's got three tiers, and then you get to the boss. The boss that you saw me fight earlier will spawn when I get all the way up to the end. But when I hit uh, this spot, the uh, the first boss will, will spawn from all the way back in the first chapter. Um, I probably won't even make it past him. We'll see.
And then a uh, second boss here. Oh, and the uh, the only way to progress this bar is to actually build. So every time I build something, the bar fills up. Hey, no problem. I'm still not all that sure how it all works. But when this boss spawns, he's going to fill in a bunch of tiles around here to make himself stronger. It's kind of scary. Uh, let's see. Oh, bandit camp. Every two, every two uh, villages that you put on the on the board spawns a bandit camp. And these bandits, they can actually steal the gear right off of your body. Kind of sucks. Uh, but hey, that's how it goes. Uh, let's see what's gonna happen. I might spawn the boss here with this tile. Not yet. Good. Ooh, a new book. Ooh, okay. So, it's got summon quality on it. My skeleton level will go down a little, but the quality of the skeletons will go up. I'm gonna put that on. Yeah, so I went from 398 to 348. Uh, sort of. A little bit. At summon quality 47, you might see better skeletons spawning. Oh, does it? I don't know, maybe it does. I really haven't paid attention. Oh, these over here? Yeah. Yep, there's, an, uh, there's a skeleton warrior. There's a friendly skeleton. These guys are high damage, but low health. Then you'll, you might see a tank. You might actually see a tank uh, skeleton spawn now. There you go. Skeleton guard. Low damage, but high HP. And they attack him first. hoping to get some more gear before I fight this boss. Uh, if I put down one more tile, he's gonna spawn. Ooh, that might be good. Hmm, not really. It's actually a higher tier ring, but it's not as good. Well, you know what? I'll put it on anyway. Like, uh in terms of other players around the world type of thing. Oops. No, I'm afraid there isn't. Would be cool if there was. But okay, I just spawned the first boss at uh, this level. You can see I'm sitting here right at my home base and he spawned, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten different uh, palaces of his own. So that's 50%. He's 50% stronger now. So I'm kind of screwed. So since he spawned, I'm just going to go ahead and build out as much as I can. I didn't get a grove. That's a problem. But, you, okay, this, uh, this blacksmith guy here, a knight... I, uh, I could get some really nice gear when I kill him, if I kill him. We'll see what happens. I think there's actually two of them there. There's a better ring. Yep. Uh, nothing else, though. Oh, no, there's a, there's a bandit down here. So this bandit could do bad things to me. We'll see. I'll put another wheat field in there to buff how much it heals me. The village, that is. And we'll see if I die or not. Desert, sure. Oh, 
or thicket. Fantastic. So I'm up to 44% attack speed. That's good. Well, 44 more percent attack speed. There's the, uh, the knight. Call him a loot balloon. Just watch what happens when I kill him. Boom. All this loot just sprays out of him. It's great. Um, fortunately, none of it's what I want. Uh, nope. It may look better, but it's not. Nope. That's unfortunate. Oh, a grove. Now I get a grove. And I can't fit it anywhere. Well, let's see if I can get what's called an Oblivion card off of this guy. Nope, I got a thicket. Okay, so this, t this fight is going to be pretty darn tough. Uh, let's see, maybe I can put the grove somewhere else. Uh, I gotta hold on to it, actually. But, yeah, f first boss incoming. Time to die. This is the Lich. How is it possible? Shut up, We're gonna, we got a score to settle. I might win, I might lose. I'll probably lose. Who knows? If he attacks my skeletons instead of me, I could win. It looks like he's exactly what he's doing. Alright, I think I got him. Oh, I think he got me. He got through my shield. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm alive. But that wasted my resurrection charge. That's not good. I needed that for the final boss. <laughs> well, at least I got a better book off him. Better necklace? Not really. Two tiers higher, but it's not better. Because it doesn't have... Anything to do with my skeletons on it. Yeah, you know? Oh, man. Oh, now, of course, he gives he gives me an Oblivion card. I could have used this Oblivion card to get rid of one of his palaces and make the game easier on me, but... That didn't happen. So instead... What can I do here? I'm gonna need a couple Oblivion cards. Um, do what I want to do. That's my camp. Let's do that, and then put a grove right there. If I can put this blood grove down in this palace area, then it's like a culling strike. It'll actually kill the boss at 15% HP instead of, get ha instead of my having to get him down to 0 HP. It's pretty neat. But right now, I can't put this anywhere, necessarily. Yeah, that's just my battlefield. And there's my loot chest. Alright, did that do anything good? Um... Yes, this is actually... better than the ring I'm wearing here. Five point six five with good skeleton quality. Let's get some more spiders in. Spiders are good. There we go. Spiders are kind of easy. They drop a lot of loot, even if it's crappy loot. But I can use that loot to trade into the blacksmith and get the buff. You can see that buff above my head there, that little 22. Max is 30, 30 charges of the buff. Ah, more thicket, 
good. more river to go around. Oops, forgot to pause the game. Getting good here. Once I get up to about a hundred attack speed, that's when things really start to turn up. Hmm, there's more river. Thank you. I forget when I put this vampire palace or vampire mansion down. I think it was loop level three. So maybe next loop it'll turn into the better heal. Ooh, more spiders. Um. Yeah, I'll put them right at the beginning. bit of level in my skeletons, but this is a better better necklace. Oh no, it isn't. But this one has max skeletons of plus one on there. That's necessary. Um, ooh, okay. Permanent plus five, point five bonus to energy armor for every summoned skeleton. That's really powerful, especially early like like it is now. Um, ah, there's my magic HP, so every time I summon a skeleton we should see this go up every couple of, couple of them. So that's 59 right now. 60. So yeah, my uh, my shield will start gaining power as I keep going around. That's that's very helpful. Not better. Not better there either. And yeah, none of this is better gear, even though it's higher level. Some of it. Looking for another Oblivion card. Not getting it. Grove. Um, the Grove right there. Blood Grove right here. Uh, well, these... You can see there's some locked away. Those will never open up, depending on which character you choose, whether it's the Warrior Rogue or uh, the Necromancer. They'll have different sets of their own, but uh, the name of the game is really just upgrading your gear when you find 
better ways to uh, to upgrade some gear even if it's got a higher tier number will be worse than the gear you're wearing um, definitely not like a, like Genshin where you just keep improving your gear over and over again this you gotta you gotta find the pieces of gear that drop hope hope and pray <laughs> that you find the better gear like all this gray tier stuff, that's probably never going to be worth it. These are wooden soldiers, wooden warriors right here. They're made of wood. Pretty crazy. Animated wood. Uh, let's see. I should probably get another grove in somewhere. Maybe right here. The blood grove right there to help me kill everything. Yeah, I like it. Mr. Loot Balloon here. Shoots out all this freaking loot. I love it. Um, I could lose a little quality pump up my skeleton's level by 54.54%. That'll get me over level 6. Yeah, I think that's good. And yeah, I'm skeleton level 6.19. Not bad. Uh, and I should start building over here now. Running out of room. Like, I've already planned out, if the game will help me out, I've already planned out bringing this river straight across here, over the top, and back down this way, um, and over this way. So, I actually probably stretch it all the way over to the end if I can. Not sure. Oh, we got some bandits. Let's see if they steal any of my gear. I got lucky. They can actually steal it out of your bag or right off of your character. Um, well, the river, uh, if you look at the tooltip in the bottom right over here for the river, it doubles the effects of adjacent landscape tiles. So these, uh, these thickets and the forest, they increase my hero attack speed by 1% or 2%. Uh, with the, uh, the river next to them, they actually increase by uh, four percent attack speed or two percent attack speed so that's a huge boon um, it's good for the build I, I gotta get as much attack speed as possible because I always want all the uh, all the skeletons that I can on the board um, and the faster my attack speed the faster I actually summon the skeletons it's pretty wild uh, oof. It almost breaks your brain trying to think it. Ooh, that might be a good ring. Um, okay, so... This might be good. If I equip it in my right slot here, I'll lose some skeleton level, but I'll get some quality back. It might be worth it. Make sure I'm always getting out those uh, skeleton rogues and the skeleton guard. So yeah, I think I'll do it. So I dropped below six, but the quality of the skeletons is better. Let's see what happens. Could have been a mistake for all I know. build all the, the deserts and the, uh, the dunes on the inside now. Uh, nothing. Oh, what's that? Eh, skeleton level. Nice, but I don't need it. More river, that's what I'm looking for.
Hmm. I've never pumped my uh, skeleton quality up over a hundred percent. I wonder what happened. I, I'm doing this for uh, for testing's sake right here. Now I've got a hundred percent summon quality. Let's see if uh, summons even better skeletons. Probably not. Or a river, I'll take it. Hmm. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. That's alright. Now I really need more forest and uh, thicket. Ah, the loot balloon. Here we go. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. Skeleton level 5.2. Five point one. Ooh, max skeletons. This might be worth it. Uh, it's random. Any monster can drop any card. Uh, there are cards that seem to be weighted heavier, like the Oblivion card that I'm looking for to get rid of this bandit camp. The card that'll destroy the camp. Um, I'll see maybe four or five of those during a run, whereas I see all of these other cards a whole hell of a lot more. Uh, but honestly, I didn't get anything here that I want to use on my character. That sucks. Um, I mean, this is close. Actually, this would get me up over six. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it. 6.01, summon quality 75. And sometimes they don't even drop a, a card. Oh, this one did. But I'm really looking for those forest and thicket cards at the moment. That would be nice to have. I really got to get my attack speed over a hundred percent. That last run of mine, the one that you dropped in on, that was a nearly perfect run, I gotta say. Uh, this one... shoot. No, not good enough. This run is not nearly as perfect. <laughs> Ooh, max summons. Uh, nah, I can't use it. Ah, oh, there's forest though. Oh, a lot of forest. Good. And there's the second boss. I'm already really close to that second boss. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. Still haven't gotten an Oblivion card. But this, uh... This ransacked village has turned into a Count's Lands, if you look down in the right there. The village is thriving under the Vampire's protection, and its inhabitants are very generous. Heals 200 HP upon entering. Basically a full heal. And it gives me a quest with a better reward. The quest is if you see this scarecrow down here, he's got a little crown on him. That's the quest. <laughs> if you kill that scarecrow, he'll drop a better piece of loot. And that's random too. You never know which enemy is going to be the quest enemy.
I was really, uh, really hoping to hit another level and get another trait before I hit this boss, but I don't think it's going to happen. We shall see. Got a loot balloon right here. Pop. Uh, evasion, quality, nope. Ooh, that's a better book. Is this better? So, 5.93, 5.5, This book is a lot better. Went up to 7.34 from 6.01. That'll help with the boss a lot. Uh, now this and that. Nope, not good enough. getting pretty beefy. I like it. Now, hopefully the, uh, these guys don't steal my loot. Nope, I'm good. Ooh, thank goodness. They're scary. I fear those bandits more than anything, but here comes the second boss. This is the priestess. She's got a bunch of mirrors that, uh, uh that shield her. You gotta break the mirrors before you can damage her. Well, not necessarily. They just give her a better chance of not getting hit. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna win. <laughs> well, I didn't think I would win the last run either, or the last boss, but I did. Used up one of my resurrection charges, but or my only one at the moment. Should have her. Yep, yeah, there we go. And a failure again. Till we meet again, Zealot. Alright. Stick it in the corner. Did she drop anything I can use? That's a lot of attack speed right there. I don't want to drop the skeleton level though. Hmm. This one's pretty good. This raises my uh, my skeleton level by a whole one one percent, or I don't know what they call it, plus one. This one only by 0.54, but a lot of attack speed. I don't need that, I'll be getting attack speed. Um, yeah, let's try this. See what happens. The book is much worse. All right, moving on. Another river card, two river cards. Oh, and as you can see, when my uh, when cards get pushed off the end over here, they turn into different resources that I can use for building. Pretty neat. Oh, there's my level. Uh, ooh, this could be good. Ten percent chance to keep the card after placing its tile. Or direct damage to me, and my skeletons have a 15% chance to immediately perform another attack. Um, oh my god, I just got an arsenal card. Holy shit, that's incredible. Uh, wow, this is a tough one. I think I'm gonna go with the damage counterattack. Okay, so first off, place down another battlefield for another loot chest on the way around. Um, this arsenal card. 
Where do I want to put it? Put it right here. This arsenal card will actually open up another loot slot up here somewhere. I'm not sure which one. I don't think I've ever used it on this character. Let's find out. Shield. Okay, I get a shield now. Shields can now drop. Sounds fun. Desert. Inside. Oh yeah, and I can start building up here too. Good. Good. More spiders? Yeah, sure. Okay, so things are... Things are getting spicy. Things are getting interesting. More thicket, more thicket. There's my first shield. Defense shield. Defense is great. Oh, but the uh, the arsenal that opened up the uh, this here, all the loot that I get now will be worse. Uh, by 15%. So it drops the level, or it drops the stats by 15% of the loot that drops from now on. But you get a, an extra loot slot, so... It's another balance, it's another trade-off. Possibly good, possibly bad. Not sure yet. Might be a while before I actually replace any of my other gear because of it. Uh, still looking for an Oblivion card as well. Now I need more river. Yeah, definitely. Would have preferred if it even came later, but it's the kind of thing where you, you ought to use it anyway. Better shield. Yep, better shield. Desert. Uh, I'll go up the middle here. Evasion, summon quality, no- oh, hey, there's an Oblivion card, thank goodness. Okay, I can get rid of this bandit camp. Thank god. Uh, let's see. Should I put another grove in somewhere? Nah, not yet. I got this whole space over here I need to fill in. I don't need to fill it in. I just could. to continue the, uh, the thicket in the forest around this way without the, the river there. But I am over 100 attack speed, that's important. Another Oblivion card, good. I'm gonna use that right away. Um, but where? Right here. Ah, oh, but I don't have... I don't have a blood grove. I need another one of these blood groves to put down by my camp down here so the boss dies quicker. And I just don't have one yet. Still, though, I'm gonna make room for it and as soon as I get that blood grove card, it's going right there. shield. Yep, gonna have to continue the forest without the river. So I'm not gonna get the big old bonus from it, but that's alright. It'll still add up. Hey, there's some river. Good. I'm 
Mr. Loot Balloon. Just getting bonked. Very nice. Oof. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to wait for level 10 gear before I can really replace anything. Except for maybe this ring. Maybe that ring. Um, here's a nice tower shield. Big defense. Oh yeah. Good stuff. I didn't have any defense on my last run. Had like seven. Here's some river. I wouldn't mind another town over here somewhere. I just can't seem to get one of those to pop either. Hmm. I might want to cool it on these deserts for a while. <laughs> cool it on the desert. If only. Ooh, better shield? No. Although, it does have summon quality and skeleton level on it. Just 11 less defense. That might actually be worth it. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Game doesn't want to help the tiles I need. I think there's still one bandit there. Am I wrong? I gotta check again. Yep, there's a bandit. He could spell trouble. Oh, he didn't. Didn't take any of my gear. Thank goodness. And enemy level 8 now. That's okay, I'm skeleton level 8. So, we're good for now. Huh. That's pretty cool. That's a ghost of a ghost right there. The enemy became a ghost, and then the ghost became a ghost. Cheeky. Uh, let's see. Mm, not good. Not good enough. None of this is good enough. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Drop that in there. Forest. Forest. Need some river. Ah, there's a blood grove. That's popping in right there. As you can see, it's covering the, the camp tile. And the boss will die at 15% health, if I can get it that low. Sucks that the river's gonna do nothing until I get it over here, though. That's why I was not too happy with the way the map generated at the beginning. Hmm. This is good. I don't need the summon quality, but I do need the skeleton level. Better shield, alright. More spiders? Sure. out for the rivers. Can't help myself. Gotta build.
Ooh, another battlefield. That's more loot. Let's see if I want to put it anywhere. Uh... Yes. Right there. Sand dune, sure. Finally, a village. Good, good, good. Let's see, how many do I have? One, two. Only two. Okay. Fantastic. Question is, should I make it... Nah, I'm not gonna make it a uh, vampire village. And now the villagers are coming all the time. But I don't need them. Ooh, a 10. Hmm, I wonder. Hmm. This is a tough choice right here. I could replace this number six, or this level six ring. I lose half of my quality of the skeleton, so. But I gain two levels for my skeletons. I gotta do it. I gotta try it. I can't replace this one because it has a max skeleton of one on there. Um, and I don't have the perk that gives me another skeleton, so I, I really need this ring. But, my skeletons are now level 10.8 compared to the enemy level of just 8. That's good. Um, let's continue. Ooh, a river and a thicket. Very nice. Hopefully I can draw that river around. It'd be helpful. Huh, might happen. Oh wow, what are these? Reeds! Spawns a fishman every three days. I've never seen those before, that's a new tile. I didn't know that could happen. That might be a bad thing. Spawns a fish dude. I will play this sand dune. Actually, you know what? Here's a little... Here's a little meta game for you. Let's see if I can do it. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna put a... Uh, I'm gonna put a village right here to block one of these... Uh, block one of these tiles and block the fish dude from coming in. Oh boy. Spawned a bandit camp, though. I forgot about that. Oh well. <laughs> His life. Hopefully I get an Oblivion card soon so I can take care of that. Ooh, I could put another village in to block the fish guy. Um, oh, and there's the third boss. This dude is pretty wild. Black hole man. Ooh, actually, I could put in wheat fields too. What's up, Mochula? Welcome. Uh, let's see. Can I put this anywhere I want? Hmm. Not really. 
All right. Good morning, good morning. Is it still morning for you out there? Yeah, it is, right? Good enough. All the loot. Uh, let's see. Right there? Sure. Do I want more spiders? Why not? Ah, uh, more forest. Good stuff. Ooh, a loot balloon time, times two. This should be... This is gonna fill up my bags. Oh my god. Almost. Um, none of it I want though, right? <laughs> Well, maybe. Eight. Ah, uh, there's no plus skeletons here. Although, this is a nice shield. Um, it's a straight up upgrade, even though I lose a little evasion. Not a big deal. Defense, skeleton level. Yep. The rings. I'm never going to take off this ring. Oh no! That sucks, I know that you gotta kill the dogs too. It's crazy. This game is wild. I got to the, uh, I got to the final boss today. I didn't beat him, but I got to him. Uh, let's see, is there anything else I want to do here? Nope. Spiders? Nah, not yet. Big book. Okay, does this beat it? Um, so it'd be. Four, nine, three, six, four. This should increase a little bit. Yeah, okay, I'm over skeleton level 11 now. Good. crappy amulets. Alright, here we go. Boss number three. Let's see what happens. I'm probably gonna get my PP slapped. Um, woof. Oh yeah. Oh, well, I don't know. As long as I keep getting rid of his uh, dogs, I might, might pull through. I do have the uh, the blood grove on him. As long as he doesn't hit me too hard. As long as the dogs don't kill me. This is the hard part. Yep, there it goes. Done. Uh, I'm gonna resurrect. That hurts. That really hurts. Watch me go again. Yep. <laughs> uh, take all. Retreat. Now well, that's how the game goes right there. Um, what am I looking for? Do I have... Uh, I still need two more shards to make an astral orb. And then I can craft astral orbs. Um, cause yeah, I haven't been able to, uh, to disintegrate one yet, or decompose one. After this run, after this next run, I should be able to. Uh, let's see, unless I want to do anything else. Hmm. 
I could, yeah. I'm gonna upgrade the war camp. And more training. I could upgrade it again. But... I think I should save my shit. Uh... Oh, like, uh... In your supply? Over here? Uh, mud huts. Uh, first you have to... You have to make sure... That your warehouses are up. Yeah, you can build two of the warehouses. You can't upgrade them, but you can build them. Um, and then, yeah, I've got a bunch of these mud huts everywhere. Mud hut there, mud hut there, there. You can see I built a lot of them. In fact, it tells you... I've got 14 mud huts. Alright, Rex. Thanks for coming. I appreciate it. Yeah, Mochilo, it's the, uh, the mud huts that actually increase. Actually, let me, uh, I think I want to build one more, in fact. Um, so, actually, let me go here. Uh, in my supply, I've got 43 of 44, right? Um, if I build another mud hut... Uh, let's go over here. Now I've got 43 of 45 instead of 44. And then all the other builds. Um, then all the other builds increase your, uh, your storage capacity. Yeah, it's pretty cool, right? Uh, let me see. Supply. I gotta add more supplies in. Because I got two more slots now. 15 when I heal, or when I pass camp, let's see, plus one to vampirism, minus four from vampires, oh, that's gonna help. Damage to all undead and increase damage done to boss by four. Question is, what else? Let me try and craft something. Oh, I don't have any orbs. But, can I make any? The synthesizer, oh, they're 300 each. Oof. Alright, I'll get rid of some wood. Go down to 100 here. Then I'll craft some of these. Maybe three. And I'll make some food. Two food. Cheese. That's a good one. Two cheeses. Very nice. Isn't it though? It's pretty wild. I could I can make a lot of food. Or store a lot of food at least. Um one HP after killing an enemy. Is there anything I want to get rid of? Two max HP. Um, since I just added... Or, oh, okay. New damage to all I'm dead. I think I can get rid of the meat stew for more cheese. I think I like that idea. Why not? I was hoping to make more uh, kitchen knives, but... Oh, I didn't. I was making food instead of tools. Eh, that's alright. I got some farming to do. Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna upgrade a mud hut here. 
want to find out what that does exactly. It says camp item slots, furniture and tools. Does that mean... I'll also have another slot open. I don't know. Let's find out. People are happy. Okay. Now they live in actual houses. Can I be considered the mayor now? <laughs> Easy there. Hey, you have a good one too, man. Take it easy. Enjoy uh, your work day. Yeah, I hear you. I'm just ending mine, but... You know. That's how it goes. Do what you can to enjoy it. And I'll see you next time. I'm gonna start another run, I think. Okay, so that didn't give me another craft slot. Or another uh, unlocked slot. That's all right. I'm slightly more powerful. I think I'm gonna farm Act 3. Maybe Act 2? Nah, uh, Act 3. With... Oops, I fucked up. <laughs> I forgot to change my uh, card here. Got to go with Arsenal. I think I'm going to keep everything else the same. Arena. Outpost, nah, it's good, but it's not good enough. Um, yeah, okay. here. Should I start it up this way? Yeah, I think I'll go up this way. Oh, I don't like this. I'm gonna have to start here and then go up. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so if I start the river here, out uh, to here. I'll mark that as my turning point. No, no. This here. Okay. This will be the outside. Go up. Yep, got it. Grove. Right there. Oblivion right away. Fantastic. around 30 mid 30s the amount of uh, tiles there on the road
they're selling right off the bat. Wish I had other stuff though. Ooh, river. There we go. Blood Grove. Alright. Early blood. Nice. Start building over here. Let I know my shape. Finally, a ring. Yeah, a magic damage ring. That's alright. Um. That sucks. Wish I had a new new weapon. Really need some river cards. There we go. Halfway through, sure. Vampire, sure. Oops. Okay, game, how about you give me the, uh, the forest cards I need? Close. Supplement my attack speed. Nah, not yet. Ooh, another jeweler's magnifying glass. That's awesome. Needed those last game. Funny.
Yeah, getting some pretty wicked uh, early gear here, but hmm, should I do magic to all or uh, damage to all instead? Hmm, maybe. I'll think about it. Excuse me. Probably should have thought about it already. Using my potions already. Dang. Oh, so close to a level. Next fight, will this be enough? Yeah! Blade of Dawn or Resurrection Charge? Blade of Dawn. Hopefully the Resurrection Charge comes around again. Vampirism, huh? Wait, how much is this? 11? I should get more than that, right? Yeah, 12. Because I got some bonus I thought I had more than that, but okay. Not a problem. Battlefield. Love it. Evasion? And damage? Alright, cool. Hey, more evasion. Nice. Give me the chest. Hmm. Lower max HP. Better everything else. Retaliation and attack speed. How fast can my attack speed go? I guess we're gonna find out, right? Just need more river cards. That's not a river card. It's alright. There we go. Forty-two percent attack speed. Forty-four. Oh, but that's on a corner. Once it stretches around. So let's see. Will this be six per ten? Will I have fifty the next uh, river card I get? That's the question. Does it already count? Big damage. Big retaliation. 
think I like the attack speed better. Hmm. Okay, so 45 attack speed. What do I get when I put this here? 50. Alright. How about some more river cards? River dance. Ticket, yes. Forest, okay. Could be better, but I'll take it. Ah, uh, finally another village card. I'm surprised I haven't gotten a uh, blacksmith yet. Village, village, village. Poppy down here. Wheatfield, wheatfield. Oblivion. Forest. Desert. Grove. I don't need another grove necessarily, but I'll take it. Ah, oh, shoot. River, thank you. Wait, fifty eight. 61. Huh. Thought it would have been more. Hello. Attack speed vampirism. Lose evasion. I think that's okay. Defense more, evasion less. I lose all my evasion. Screw it. Another battlefield. Yes, please. Blood path in between. Smith's Forge. That's what I was looking for. That should go towards the end, I do believe. At least this one. How close to the end? That close. That close. There we go. Come on, more river cards. I want me some swamp people. I ain't seen one yet. I didn't see that. That's not better. Just got more HP on it. 
new level. 25%. They don't have as much abilities. Yeah. Sure. stuff. Is this better? Slightly. Smith's Forge to help me out over here. Yes. Big defense. That's all right, though. Keep what I got. Or river. I like it. Hey, read. Every three days, huh? Defense evasion. I need to try and pump vampirism somehow or other. Gen, so I gotta keep the vampirism. River. More reeds. I don't know what they do, but I like it. Okay, this is a free village. I want to oblivion. I haven't been watching. Good to go. Not getting any cards though. That's a problem. Santa Duna. shield. Gotta do it, right? After the fight. And it's got some regen on there. Love it. I think that's worth it too, just slightly. to do though. Uh oh, that's a lot of desert. Goodbye HP. Probably the wrong idea. Another Smith Forge. Maybe right here? 
be right here. Probably right here. I think so. Spider Bros. Um. Just on that one tile. Oh, just gonna use you to do whatever. Hey, loot balloon. Hey, little loot balloon. That's a lot of loot. Damage to all. Am I going to lose regen? Probably. Yep. Got some spicy fights coming up. Ooh, and I think I saw my, uh, my first fish dude. Spawns a fishman. Fish. Blah, 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 blah. Spawns a fishman from uh, the band Fish uh, every three days. Can't wait to see what he does. Haven't seen one yet. I've not seen what they do. I need more river though. Shoe nails. Better helm. A little bit. Better ring. Nope. Fortunately not. Oh boy. One of the wooden warriors just got buffed. Yeah, I did that right. Cool. I was scared for a second there. Sea dwellers so far from their home waters? Is this one of your marches to conquer the land? I don't understand you. Uh, but if you can understand me, come here, get out of my way. So can I pass or not? What should I do? I don't want to provoke a conflict. Blah, 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 blah. Great. Fills attack bar to two thirds after missing a hit. Oh boy, he's good at when I evade. But well, now he's dead. Oh, these wooden warriors. Youch. Where did they even come from? The ocean is very far away from here. Big damage up. Lots of damage to all. Um, yeah, I'll see how it performs. Should help with my vampirism. Ooh, more river. Do the river dance. Doing the river dance. Doing the river dance. Doing the river dance. Doing the river dance. Wait, I could have put the river there? Wait, what? I don't know about that. Ooh, loop balloon. Twenty-nine loot balloons go by. Da dun 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 da 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 dun 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 Regen, I think I need regen. Burzum, Vasion. Let's 
so hard to know what to do. Damn chess piece. Yes. New helm. It's a lot of damage to all. I think I have to. Big defense, not much else. It's only eight more defense. I'll stick with what I got, thanks. Forestical. Hmm, more forest. I want to get rid of. Oh wow, they made the, the fishman quest. Give all? Nah, nothing I want to oblivion. Now if only I could get more village tiles. I want to know what the town does. That's another thing. Field. Yep. Ooh, damn. Hmm. Lose eight damage to all, but get seven magic damage. Some counter. I don't have any counter. Should I? Or should I not? Would be easy to replace if I want to replace it, though. Ooh, I see a loot balloon. Ah, oh, he came out the wrong way. I don't think there was any other way he could come out, though. They're debating me. Oop, ghost? Ghost of a ghost? No ghost of a ghost. Really use, uh, could use some forest, uh, river tiles. That would be nice. Please and thank you. Ooh, that's a lot of magic damage. But it's too much of a damage loss, otherwise. Same with this. Oh, evasion. Come uh, on, drop me a river. Uh, none of them cried. Ah, uh, these boys ain't so bad. They just don't do anything for you. Level up the Hey, there's some river. Oops. Let's put that right there. Doesn't matter. Maybe I'll get a uh, thicket I can put in instead.
What's that? Shipwreck. How did I get a shipwreck? I put it next to a land tile or a water tile. Fisherman's explosive spawns a siren once a loop. Spawns a chest once per loop. No mimics. Enemies in adjacent tiles may become boats. Uh, ghosts. Cool. Still finding out new shit about this game. Love it. Hello. Max HP. Ooh, a lot of attack speed. Um. Division 2. Lose a lot of vampirism. Division it is. For a blood grove. Ooh, a village. Nice. No, sir. Wheat and wheat. Too late. Too late to make it a vamp village. Wow. 150 though. Carry on. Take that shit. Oh, I think it. I didn't even see it. There it is. Now this. Not what I'm looking for, even though I like the HP. Loot the moon! Ooh. Stop using potions, bro. Just fight them, you'll be fine. Can I move that? Can't move that myself. Oh well. From a new level. Hey, more river though. Thank you. About fucking time. Loot balloon. Deadly loot balloon. More river. River. What am I up to now? 99 attack speed. Ooh, pop one of these in here. Be a free village, right? Siren. Slimy positive effect. Twenty percent of aid if there's liquid enemies in the battle. Well, there's not. But damn. She sounds good. I'll fudge that up. Where's my blood grove, damn it? Regen. Counter and damage to all. I think that's actually better. Evasion, vampirism, and regen. Yeah, that's good. It's a whole mess of fucking health. 
Lots of defense, no vampirism. Hmm. I think I take it for the regen. Seems I need it. Ah, uh, but I lost a lot of attack speed. Whoops. Should be okay. Eh, I'll take it right back. That's a lot of damage to all. A lot. Come on, man, hit it. Jesus. Where are my fucking rivers? going up. I like it. Oh, well, there's my vampirism sword, right? Ooh, and it's better. Oh, uh, did he have to be a quest objective? Ouch, he's gonna kill me here. Jesus. be dead anyway. Yeesh. When's a day gonna turn over? Oh my god, I did not see this going how it's going. dead. Okay. Really needed that. Just kidding. The fuck? Taking all of that. This is supposed to be a farming run. There's nothing of this sort. Did I even get an astral shard anywhere? I think I did. That's all right. Yeesh. That hurts. on a loss but it is 5 30 in the morning well maybe I don't take desert maybe I do
Spiders have souls. Let's find out. First off, what else did I unlock here? Shipwreck. And read. Oasis. Water from a small stream hidden in the dunes has a calming effect on you. Huh, interesting. I didn't even see that. Ooh, what's this in here? There's a lot of stuff I still haven't seen. I don't know how to get. Some sort of skeleton in here. chair, old frying pan. Ooh, I gotta add that thing in. <laughs> Do I need nails? Probably not. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ten times seven is seventy. Holy crap, seventy percent chance of finding a rare item. That's pretty nice, I think. Just give six. Oh, okay, different things. Gotcha. Metal, food. Gotcha. Interesting. Alchemy. God, I need, I need two more time shards. Those mods, por favor. So I can craft these damn things. I spent my last one, stupidly. Whoa, I don't have any stone left. stone. Where do I get stone? Oh! Okay. I think I'll just do a standard with rock. Forest? Yeah, let's try that. That should be fun. But, I gotta go pee. I'll be right back.
Okay. Last run of the day. Or the night. Or the afternoon. Or whatever. Wherever you're from. Ugh, my nose. I hate this weather. It's too damn cold for this time of year. Where is global warming when you need it? Oh, wait. It's not a thing. That's right. I forgot. Alright, I don't know how to use zero milestone. So, farming run. Stick that in the corner. Yep. I don't know how this is going to go. <laughs> hey, some river right away. Right away. Hmm. Start it over here. Put the rock over here. Use some other tiles though, game. Gee, thanks. I don't care. Stone, mountain, whatever. Doesn't matter. In the end, it just doesn't matter. But I don't get anything from it. Oh, I should have turned Battlefield off. Well, that'll be some wood, I guess. if I put a, a rock next to the water. In this run, it doesn't do shit. Just try and shit. Spiders? Yep. doesn't do anything. Thought it might. It didn't. Oh, I wonder what meadows do next to forests and thickets, if anything. Rock? Does this do anything? Wait a minute. Did they buff that? Oh, they buffed rocks and mountains, huh? Interesting. Doesn't matter for this room. Curious. Awesome. 
counter. I guess. Very funny game. <laughs> River, please. No, nope, that's not river. It's okay. Wait, is that first time we found this river? Yeah, it does. Cool. Good to know. Oh, doesn't help. There, whatever. I don't want to spawn spawn a loot balloon yet, but I don't think he'd give me anything. Or would he? I don't know. Range shot. What does range shots? Do those guys do range shots? I do not know. 
Ah, oh, shit. I wanted to go through here. Eh, whatever. Nothing with crit on it ever sucks. Kirby Mountain Goblin bullshit. God damn it. I should get rid of that right now, but I'm not gonna. about counter. In which case, why didn't I see that? That hurts. Big pretties. Grove. Really gonna help against that guy. Um, backwards here, sort of, but in a good way. There's 8 evasion, still up some, from 30, and crit damage chance goes up, good. Alright.
Back to the loo. Surprised I haven't seen any more villages. Oh, hello. There's a spider down there. Do I care? A little bit. Goodbye, bandit camp. Band camp. Just looking for the stone, thanks. This could hurt. No good tiles, or well, at least none that I want. So there's got to be three on a tile for this to work. Res. Another village, eh? There's a fuck all room. Doing whatever the hell I want room. Yeah, that's what I call it. Interrupted. Spiders? Yes. Mm, more resource, please. What did I just get? Garlic. Not bad. Don't think I'll use it, but okay. wardrobe. I think I have one of those already. Yeah, not that useful. Hmm, wheat field, finally.
did those come from? Actually, better than what I'm wearing by a lot. We pulled them for a thicket tile. I want to see what happens on the bend here. Did we count it twice? I don't know. Grove. Guess I should have one of those in here. If only I could find a blood grove. on the left. Oh boy. Do I want to lose? more than a quarter of my evasion for a little bit of crit damage. Not really. And I'll lose crit chance. Oh no wait. Yeah. Shit. That sucks. I need that dirk. Oh well. I can't believe how long it's taken to actually spawn this boss. I'm not getting any tiles I need. So I got nothing to spend. Why no tiles, game? I'm empty. Empty through and through. Six attack speed. 64. It actually works double. That's incredible. That's incredible. Grove? Yeah, sure. Where though? Either one will be fine. Probably there. Increases damage done to boss by 4%. Super. Oh god, they made the fucking... Oh god, I'm screwed. Why can't I find any fucking tiles? That's another thing. Ooh, one.
Big X. Bigger X. Well, I guess we're doing this. Barely had a chance to crit here, but whatever. Oh, it just might help. Oh, they do help. 31% chance to crit. That's better. Thank you for some fucking tiles, game. Village, one, two, three. Don't have an obliterate. Okay, then. Meat field before the boss. Fields. Making all the toughest enemies my quests. Oh, I'm getting hungry. better. Just a little bit. Sucks I have to get rid of some crit chance. Could be dead right here. Yep. Well, that's what I get for choosing the wrong character. This setup was for somebody totally different. Meant to go back to the warrior. Oh, jeez. That's hilarious. It doesn't matter. It's still gonna slap my pee pee. Ah, well. Oh, yeah, I have that resurrect charge. Gotta use it. Maybe I'll win. Not gonna win. Oh, and the hell continues. Does give me if I can get a few more river tokens or tiles. I'd love to figure this out. Just need three more before I die. Ah, goodbye. Goblins.
Ah, shipwreck. Where did these come from? Not better? Not better. Critical damage. Magic damage. Crit chance. Crit damage. Crit damage chance. Things, big things going on here. Do I want to lose evasion and attacks? Or uh, hmm, I don't have any defense. Maybe that's a good thing. Let's do it. Ninety to one hundred and thirty-four damage. What if I crit? Let's find out. 144. Oh, that was pretty hefty. Love a river card, please. And in oblivion. Didn't get any cards. River me, baby. Or not. Blood Grove. Need one more river card to test something. Hey, there it is. Finally. I can put it there. Bridge does nothing. Only needed to <laughs> increase the length of a river. Ah, uh, that's funny. I was hoping it would have something. Something to do. Okay, let's spawn this freaking boss. Oops. Village. Mm. See if I got an oblivion card at any point. Do that. 
think I'm attacking the guy in the back first. Ooh, I'm fucked. Or not? Probably. What's that? Oh, it's River again. Okay. Yeah, I'm screwed. Oh, I can res again? Why not? Undying Chivo get. All the resources, please. Screwed when I get to the boss, though. What's this do next to... Goblin Camp? Nothing. Okay. I didn't do shit. Well, it did, but I don't know. A little more resources. That's what I'm here for. Only got five. Huh. Alright. Let's do it. Slap my peepee, -pee, baby. I got her if I hit her one more time. So if I hit her one more time, there we go. A retreat. Oh my god. I still need one more fucking time shard. Eh. Unbelievable. I'm just gonna have to make the stone with the wood. Break the wood down, make the stone. Let's do that. Er... Alchemy. Using that I can break down for a lot of stuff. Res tokens, but nah. Keep those. Wait, I could decompose this? I didn't know I could decompose those. Oh! I have Astro Lord now. Pose. Synthesize. So now I know how to do it all. Awesome. Build. What did I want to do? I wanted to upgrade something. The gym. I wanted to upgrade the gym. Unlocks the town card. Real temple of knowledge, the best temple of all. Let's 
suburbs. Not town, suburbs. Increasing experience gained from killing enemies by one. Well, that's cool. All right. Wonder what happens if you put him next to a village. Um, let's see. So I'm going to leave it like this. What, uh, what other fun stuff can I do? Every three days, every two days, they can hit me from afar. They can hit me from Jafar. Um, let's do it like this. And I'll leave it as a rogue. And I'll figure out which menu, or which uh, chapter I want to do at that point. Maybe even four. Not sure. But, one more thing before I go. Supply. Didn't I get something I wanted to use? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Damage to all undead. Minus four from vampires. What other jewelry do I have that I want to use? None? Probably. Yeah, so I'll put on the vampire thing. All right. I'm set up for my next run. Reorganize that crap, damn it. Dinner table, time for passing the campfire. Um, I think I'm good. I think I'm set up for my next run. Let me build one more. Wait, should I do another forest? How do I get more? Get more rock. Is there any way? Probably not. Well, it doesn't seem like it. But I will build one more farm. forest and I won't be able to build another ok 
Okay, it's either farm. Yeah, I'll build a, another farm. Where? Right there. Things uh, metamorphosize. All right, cool. I'm done. Well, if anybody's here, y'all have a good one. See you next time. That was a nine and a half hour stream. God damn. Take it easy. <laughs>